the freestyle <laughs> by Corey Holcomb and this bitch. Because I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> I don't like your daughter, bitch. Ever since I saw the little hoe, niggas knocking on my motherfucking door. <laughs> Is Trina there? Is she coming out? I say, hey, put that thing in that bitch mouth. I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> Going in my refrigerator. Every nigga that nut in her, somehow they hate her. Oh. Her two kids that she kept because she thought them dudes was going to give her fuck. <laughs> but then they ducked out on her ass. <laughs> fuck that silly slut. Even though that bitch do got a big ass butt. But I won't fuck her though. Because it's your daughter. So get the daughter out of my face before the slaughter. I don't like your daughter, bitch. Oh, I told you he has some shit. <laughs>
The Eagles did that. I wish I had a better Congratulations, Philadelphia. You motherfuckers won and towed the city up. That's yeah, real yeah. nigga shit. <laughs> and it was, it was, it was white people white towed people, the city right. up. Yeah. They won gas station up. They yeah. was like, ain't nobody fair for shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's that drunk shit. They said that over 8 million people called in sick from for work Monday. Man, yesterday. they was fucked up. <laughs> that motherfucker can't go to work, god damn it. They was like, what time are we supposed to be to work? <laughs> 30 uh, minutes. Oh, shit. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I ain't even cleaned I'm just up. Yet. Drunk of fifth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That's, yeah, that's a good game. They saw a dude throw a car like a rock. <laughs> he picked it up. Anyway, man, congratulations, Philadelphia. Y'all beat Tom Brady. Who a lot of people didn't like Tom Brady because he didn't go see Obama at the White House. Yeah, but it's a lot of Eagles players talking about not going to see um, Trump. Trump, well, including he, white guys. Well, you know, wow. not only did he not go see Obama, but, you know, he had that hat in his locker. Remember, that was the bigger thing. What did that He had say? the make, make America Great Again red hat in his locker. Remember yeah. that? That's what started it mm. all. Yeah. Wow. Like, are you serious? I mean, like, you know what I'm saying? I think Tom Brady had a great career, but fuck Tom Brady. Straight up. Yeah. Fuck a Tom Brady, man. And that cheating. They tried to cheat so bad in that game. It was, if you know anything about football, did you see that shit? They just kept trying to give him chances. Yeah, the yeah. man threw the ball to the dude at the back of the end zone. They let the Patriot player grab him for the ball. Yeah, yeah. I said, what the, what the fuck? Did, that, did y'all just see this shit? See, I didn't watch the whole game. I was having a good day by myself. And then I treated myself to dinner at Stevie's on Pico. So I went there, and they happened to have the game on. So I, uh, ca- I caught the fourth quarter. That's it. Yeah, I, watched I heard y'all say so. I see you motherfuckers like, yeah, Kevin Hart and all that shit. I was going to talk about Y'all don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin was with them motherfuckers. Yeah, he's a big fan. <laughs> no, they paid him to do a show, I heard. Oh, Kevin wow. Kevin was with the team. Yeah, but that but, still doesn't take away. You don't go on Deion Sanders' Post game show, and did you see that part? No, I, I don't know nothing that. about that. Oh, I know no, that this he year, he said that for he was certain Dion had to escort him off. <laughs> I didn't even you know that. One. No. I saw him. Kevin had been drinking a little bit. A little bit. I thought it was a part of an act. Did you see at the end when he was trying and he to He was on Sports stage? Center and he said, fuck. Then he said, mm-hmm. <laughs> I was like, but he, he admitted it. He like kind of walked away like. <laughs> no, but at the end of the game, that he was, was trying funny. to get up on that stage. I thought that was a joke. I was looking, I was by myself. I was eating. No, but was did like, you notice the stage this year was extremely small? They normally had a whole team right. in the back. That's when how they, they regulate it, so they let the people come up one at a time. Too. Right, because yeah. they was worried about motherfuckers up there with that yeah. black power oh. shit. <laughs> right, they right. worried about. Yeah. Fuck the NFL. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> motherfuckers, that's the first. Look, I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. I watched the game from about the third quarter on back. From your right. house? No, I wasn't at home. Oh, I was gonna say thank God because they're gonna they're gonna uh you you gave they're gonna be the, like NFL gonna send that like, boy no, be no, talking no, that like bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> but we got his ass watching this motherfucking game. Wilson ratings, uh huh. Right. We got you. What I up, wa- now, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> I watched it on that box, right? Legally, <laughs> right? God damn it, box. God damn it, it's free box. Hell yeah. Anyway. I ain't look no, nah, but I, I'm just saying, man, that shit was funny. Ke- Kevin was so motherfucking like nigga. I'm with Let the Eagles, up, nigga. <laughs> they paid me big uh, paper to do a show. I that was a but that one motherfucker, uh, big ass white security yep. guy, was like, I don't give a fuck what they gave your little black ass. Oh, like man. Was Look at little Roosevelt Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> Get your motherfucker. <laughs> I'm glad he was, I didn't see that. Part, Kevin, but. call me, nigga. You know I'm finna ride your ass for that shit. <laughs> Call me, nigga. Oh I'm, I'm glad he was God. loose like that because he normally be in the pocket, man. He be chilling most of the time. Man, Kevin, know? he didn't give a and fuck. And then, right. then he posted that video up on Instagram. What'd he I, say? I didn't see I that. I didn't watch oh. it either, but boy, everybody's talking about it. He man, all I drunk. saw was that video where he was on Sports Center and he was standing out in the back, you know, at the little table where they had, where they be interviewing people. They was interviewing him and he said, I'm yeah. drunk. Uh-huh. I've been drinking. And then they asked him something, and then he used the word fuck accidentally. And he just was like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> He walked away. That was funny to me. Oh, I was like, no, nigga, did you funny. say fuck on TV, nigga? <laughs> Even though it's cable TV. Why, why, can't, why can't they say fuck on Sports Center? I guess because it's supposed to be a family show. Yeah. And the family watch it. Daddy, That's they shit. fucking scored. Yeah. That's what the kids yeah, be yeah, saying. Yeah. But you can read it when they say it. Even if you don't hear it, you can see their, their mouth it out. Like right. The coaches. Somebody say, nah, Corey, there's more. Laughing their ass out. 
There is, what? Let me tell you that, Kevin. Corey, I'm gonna keep posting this. Look at um women's women's blue book dot com. Oh, I that's my They're old joke. Niggas running with do it though. Yeah, nigga. Harmony. She said you gotta love Kevin Hart for that. <laughs> Philly <laughs> niggas yeah. stand the fuck yeah. up. Yeah, I got love for Philly niggas. Hey, nigga, we coming to the tower in Philly. We coming to the tower in Philly, nigga. Y'all know what I'm talking about. That theater. First time I went there, it was with Kevin Hart. God damn it. Kevin threw a nigga blessing, threw him on the show. Right. That shit was off the chain, nigga. Man. Now I'm headlining that motherfucker. All right. I'm trying to add David Banner on the show just on some different shit. Hell yeah. Just let him come up there and say what's up to the people, my hey. nigga. <laughs> on the motherfucking gray beard wisdom side of the game. <laughs> Fuck these yeah. hoes in their mid forties that kept themselves in shape. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, David Banner's solid, man. How many oh, that hold? Yeah. How many t- the tower hold? Uh, two something. Oh, okay. Two, two thousand something. something. Yeah. Hell oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Oh, fucking shit. I oh man, look, let me tell you something. We did that Philly comedy club. They got um, the, the something house. I was, I, they we sold that motherfucker. Dog, where, where them niggas at? Right. They fuck with me. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This week we in yeah. Dallas. Mm-hmm. Word. You bullshit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dallas! <laughs> the seed of the crime. Shaq all star. <laughs> Dallas, man. Dallas show me bad love, dog. Dallas Craig going to be on the show? Yeah, hell no. yeah. Craig going to be on that motherfucker with the Mexican than the motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> remember, I, remember, yeah. remember I went to that show, they was like, get your Mexican ass yeah. off. Craig was I, like, I, I ain't yeah. Mexican. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. Run up and see, nigga. That's all I got to say. Craig, violent. <laughs> Them big country ass niggas down there, you know, let me oh, tell yeah. you something about Alabama and motherfucker Texas. That's where all them little football motherfuckers oh, no, come yeah. from. Yeah. They got mm. the they high school games be like twenty thousand, right? Mm. You be like, yeah. What the fuck? All these motherfuckers want to yeah. see these little niggas? No, I love the country, man. I love the country. <laughs> Shout out to Tuscaloosa, Alabama. I got a bunch of family down there. How many bitches you fuck down there? What? Two. I, I was gonna say, there. don't put him on blast, but look, yeah, Greg, Greg don't care, boy. No, man, Greg I'm single. Singlish. 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 <laughs> I'm in a resingle ship, man. You in a resingle ship. That's good, <laughs> yeah, nigga. Yeah, straight up and down, man. I'm in a resingle ship relationship. <laughs> yeah, straight up. <laughs> I'm in a situation ship. Uh, that's situation a good, ship, situ- god damn mm-hmm. it. I'm nothing. in a drop a bitch off ship. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, go home ship. Right, yeah. Man, yeah. Man, yeah. Man, yeah. Man, that's, man. That's, <laughs> <laughs> I always know how to set the hotel doors. I put tape on that little part to make the little latch sound and shit. Oh, that's funny. Right. So I can sneak out that motherfucker got that motherfucker. I'll be like, hey, I'm gone. Oh, you yeah. don't hear that shit. Oh, I said yeah. I'm gone. <laughs> I run a room on a different floor. <laughs> I still be there, but she don't know. I just feel the yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> there right now. Yeah, yeah, for real. Well, I do. I get the connected room, goddammit. Oh, okay. Yeah. All my shit be in the connected room. <laughs> yeah, you need to go get you some drawers. I'm like, yeah, I do. Hey, yeah, yeah. never come back. Right. <laughs> I never act like I'm going downstairs to the lobby. I'm in another room, like, this bitch still here. <laughs> Damn, she don't get it? No. <laughs> no, they not. Especially when they think you got a little paper, she ain't never trying to leave. Hell no, them motherfuckers, I don't know what, let me tell you some ladies who motherfucker think motherfuckers gonna trick off on your ass like that. Ain't nobody fucking with you like that, goddammit. You get what you look like. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to money, you get what you look like. It be rich niggas who be with bitches, they can give them shit, but they be like, I can't give you shit, bitch. You ain't gonna get on your feet looking like that. <laughs> you can't get on your feet looking like that with me, You, you get on your knees, but right. not your feet, yeah. I can give you 3000 right now, but I can't give you 3000 You ain't nobody ever gave you 3000 uh, A bad investment. Right, yeah. goddammit. That's funny, man. He's a, he's a fit freeze. You get you a pair of Aldo <laughs> shoes and get the fuck away from me, bitch. <laughs> Hell yeah, some of that cheap crazy. leather. Fit freeze. Oh, the that's fit funny. Freeze. <laughs> Shout out to the big homie Freeze, yeah, that's man. Right. That's my freeze, boy. Freeze, what the fuck you doing tonight, motherfucker? Come get your hat. Did Freeze ever come get his hat? No, but I took it and then I hit him up like that next day and I was like, Freeze, I got your hat. Oh, man, thanks, D. Yeah, where are Where's you? Where's that? Wait, and no, and then I said, well, can, you, can, you can scoop it up or I can drop it off if you're work or wherever. And he was like, I'll be right there to pick it up. So I told him where I was eating lunch. And then he hit me up like 10 minutes later like, ah, I can't make it to that area. Just hang on to it. So I have it. Okay, we're going to film ourselves taking Freeze the hat one day. Oh, yeah, yeah. there you Freeze, go. Freeze, where you going to meet us at yeah. when we can give you the hat? Make it somewhere exciting so people can see it, motherfucker. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Take us to where you work. <laughs> 
<laughs> Zoe had head freeze head. God damn it. I don't know if it they wear the same size. It was a lot of niggas who head shaped like Zoe in a... Birmingham this week. Uh-oh. A lot of shark head niggas. <laughs> so they couldn't come out of their mom. They had to get the clamp. That's what happened. They got pulled was, out. No, when you get pulled out of the canal down there and you can't come out naturally, they have to use them little forceps. What's that? What do you mean? They so open they the wound? The baby. Yeah, so they put the little thing in it, uh, grab the baby's head and... Uh, Oh, they yank no, him out by the head. Oh, wow. That's yeah. the long yes, neck motherfucker. <laughs> oh, <shit>. Frank? <laughs> you got pulled out by the head Shut with some clowns? <laughs> 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 yeah, head locked him and drug right. him out. Yeah. <laughs> if he wouldn't have got pulled like that, Frank voice would have been like this. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> so got pulled out by that crowd. He was like, hey! That full Nelson tug out. Right. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to Tyson? So Tyson was yanked out too? Who was Tyson? Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Said his voice. Mike Tyson got a fat head. No, yeah. I'm talking about the voice. That ain't come out right, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I caught that immediately. Yeah. <laughs> <That's it. laughs> Mike Tyson. Yeah, he, he'll run up on you. You don't want that one. I know. I'm scared yeah, of Mike. I don't want that one. That nigga Goose the Gray said he could bring Mike up to the show. He said oh, Mike yeah. a big fan of the show. That's my favorite celebrity. I'm man. scared of Mike, dog. Oh, I love Mike. Tyson, I believe man. Mike could get motherfucking fucked up in here and be like, yo, so. <laughs> no, he don't even do that no more. Hell yeah, he would. What you say about Aries? <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Mike. He's funny. <laughs> no. I wish I would have. <laughs> I wish I had caught that one man show. I heard it was brilliant. Oh, he was no. better than some of these comics. Been doing yeah. comedy I for bet. years. Because oh, yeah, he ain't scared of shit. So he's going to say what he want to yeah. say. Mike Let Tyson. somebody say something in the audience. Let somebody heckle him. Ooh. Yeah, I don't want no parts of that. Okay. Speaking of motherfuckers running up on motherfuckers, I saw some motherfucker run up on Mickey, Ricky Smiley out in Oakland. Really? What? Some motherfucker came what up mean, on stage. It what? wasn't as bad as it was with the other comic, but. Oh, Some motherfucker uh, ran up on Ricky. Ricky don't strike me as the type of person you want to run up on. He seemed like he's handling his business. He's, Ricky Smiley, you know he's um, thin build. Right. So motherfuckers will try you. you know, I'm going to tell you something, man. It be motherfuckers in the crowd looking for stardom, man. Well, right. They'll right. try you. Not right. only that, the bad thing about comedy shows is alcohol. Alcohol. Yep. Yeah. Alcohol. And you're in close proximity to the person doing the show. Right. Right. Shit. I remember when we did that show, some motherfucker was in the front. Did I say this? He was videotaping me. No, you didn't talk about that. He had his last camera. Year, right? well, that's last last year. I, I was like, hey, man, didn't you hear them say no videotaping? That motherfucker said, man, do your motherfucking show, nigga. <gasps> oh, oh, my wow. God. <laughs> I went out there and took this nigga phone. I didn't know what was going to happen. Right, right. That nigga just stood there. And yeah. I was like, oh, puss ass nigga. Yeah. I was going through his phone. He was with his girl. I was like, he got some bad bitches in this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up. Yeah. happened out there in Oakland at the uh, Tommy T. Oh, yeah. Oakland ain't no joke either. Yeah. Man, but look, the nigga, he was like feeling, you know, he was like, he getting fired up. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm waiting. I'm like, nigga, well, we finna tear this motherfucker yeah, up. Yeah, straight up. Yeah, yeah. He was sizing me up. I was sizing him up. I was like, what? <laughs> nigga, I got your phone. <laughs> then the motherfucker, uh, 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 his, his, he got up and he acted like he was gonna do something and shit. Security guard came over there. Old dude, though. That's why they be pulling it. Because the security guard. It's garbage. Why? Well, yeah, garbage. They good niggas, but they older. They right. know. Oh, how much How much can an older motherfucker do? He could pop your ass. This motherfucker ain't about to go to jail for no. a right, right. no, no. By the time you knocked out, it's over, you know. It's yeah. too much, because what? They're going to keep people seeing people get away they with They called that, the police that. on them. I didn't even want them to call the police on them. I didn't know they called the police on them. I didn't want him to go to jail, because I felt like it was a hand. Right. Especially when I took his phone, and yeah. he ain't trying to act crazy. I was right. like, oh, this is just a nigga who thought he could pull it on me. Yeah. You know right, what I'm saying? So turned it into something fun. But most regular motherfuckers. But this is what happened to the nigga. Uh-oh. The nigga... They called the cops. This nigga trying to act tough, but he still ain't come up and get his phone. Right. I came and got my phone. Hell yeah. <laughs> I ain't saying I'm, I'm not saying I'm tough, but I'm with a girl. Ain't no nigga finna snatch my phone from me. <laughs> Fuck that. Hmm. Fuck that. We wrestling, nigga. Right, right. Straight. No matter what happened, I'm a, squeezing a, you, nigga. A, sc- a scuffle <laughs> off. We gonna have a scuffle right, off. Nigga. <laughs> yeah. Man, this nigga had mad warrants. 
Oh, the police came. Well, he don't have no business acting like that. That's anyway. what I'm saying. What I'm like, hell? this nigga out here clowning. Old girl needed a ride home. Plenty of niggas was trying to drop her <laughs> off. I don't know who dropped her off, goddammit, but that nigga had them warrants, goddammit. Yeah. And this, it was a Friday night. Yeah. That means yeah. he got the whole weekend, don't he? Oh, yeah. He yeah. going to be in there until at least the Monday. Whole weekend. Yeah. Regular, on some stupid yeah. shit. Mm. People don't get this how we make our money. They, I don't think he was yeah. trying to punk me after no, I took his no. phone. He just was, I guess he was just ignoring motherfuckers saying no videotaping. Yeah. He must be one of them slow motherfuckers. No, nah, they, you know, regular people don't get, this is directly tied into your livelihood. This is how you feed your family. Mm. Man, I yeah. took that nigga phone, dog. I was, <laughs> I was on stage like this. <laughs> the whole crowd was looking like, it's for the Did piece you erase the video, though, at least? I didn't erase the oh. shit. Because I wasn't even thinking about the shit like that. I was looking, waiting on this nigga to be a man. Right. Nigga, come get your motherfucking phone, nigga. <laughs> nope. That nigga didn't want it. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. what I'm saying. Maybe this nigga didn't even know. He thought I was bullshit, nigga. Nah, yeah, this ain't no game. But stop running up on niggas on stage, all you crazy motherfuckers out there in the crowd yeah. and shit. Plus, I be, I be with a crew. I ain't saying we gangsters, but goddamn it, <laughs> my opener motherfucker is an army nigga. Straight up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, I know that. Lav Love is in the motherfucking army. I know he works out like crazy. Yeah, Lav Love be getting up jogging with Rocky Four in his headphones. Except his girl name ain't Adrian. He be like, Shaniqua! Shaniqua! Ah, that's funny. That's too much. That's wild. Lav Love do some shit that he, because he learned how to edit. So he got some shit he do. Check out his comedy beatdown. Google Lab Love comedy beatdown. Say we 5150 niggas. Corey told us to check this shit out, nigga. Yeah, last sure. the people. I think he do a good job editing the shit. Just like little bullshit that he see on the internet and shit like What's that. What's it called? Is what? The comedy beatdown. Comedy beatdown. Mm-hmm. I think that's what it's called. I'll check him out. I think, laugh, if that's not what it's called, call me. And if you ain't watching the show, fuck you, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, running up on these comics on stage, y'all, that ain't right. Because most no. comics don't travel with no mob. Most comics just be by themselves. And uh, I know my man Ricky Smiley ain't the type of motherfucker to be fighting. You can see in the video, he ain't. What Ricky was Smiley it for? Ain't, what was Ricky it? Smiley what ain't been a fight. Because first of all, let me tell y'all motherfuckers something. Motherfuckers be trying to pick fights with comics who work at these clubs. And then they sue. But don't yeah. go to a, com- a, a comedy show if you can't take, in other words, if they, you, anybody can get called out. Right. So if you can't nigga, take if that. if you can't take the joke, nigga. You can get poked. <laughs> Bring your ass on that <laughs> stage with me. Oh, get okay. fish gutted. Dude, yeah. dude in um, South Carolina got mad charges put on him for that shit he I did when he yeah. ran up on, on Steve Oh, that's Brown. a strike. That's a fel- What he did is a felony. That's, that's a couple weapon, felonies. Right. Yeah. Pick that thing up. Oh. Yeah, it's a rap. Wow. Yeah, we ain't rappers. It ain't like we running around here, you know, fronting and acting like we hard or nothing. We just trying to make y'all laugh, man. Man, we just trying to make you laugh, man. But I'm here to tell you, man, I don't give a fuck what you feeling. Don't run up <laughs> on me, my nigga, because I'm scared of you. I, I don't know you. I'm scared of you. Yeah, I do up. stupid shit that might get you and me hurt. I don't want to get hurt. I want to laugh with you, my nigga. Yeah. Just be like, man, holler at me after the show, nigga. I'll buy you a drink just, just for being bold enough to walk up off me. I don't want it, nigga. I don't want it. For real. God damn it. A lot of niggas be mad. It was some girls fighting in the bathroom. Uh, oh my at your last show? Yeah, man. Oh, in man. Birmingham. Them bitches was fighting. Talking oh about, my. yeah, I'm the side bitch. What, bitch? Oh, Uh-oh. man. He be with me, god damn it. That's what everybody was telling me. You oh. know, we be selling shit at the table. They say, dog, you had some girls in there fighting. The main girl was fighting the side bitch. The side bitch oh, followed the, the main. Yeah. No, over the dude. The side bitch was at the show. She <gasps> followed the main girl in the bathroom. Ooh, we. Dude couldn't go in there and help her. He would have been looking at them pissy pussies. The last time I did a show with you, I remember you uh, a couple fought at your show. You don't remember that? The, the girl <laughs> wanted to get up and walk out, and she was trying to leave. And the dude was like, nah, you go, go wait in the car. I'm going to stay here and listen to this fire. Oh, damn, she got up and left. That happened the last time. We yeah. I, remember, I remember one time we was in San Diego. This dude, girl, got up and leave, and he stayed there. Yeah. Yeah, I just kept that doing just the happened show. happened in Ontario. Remember? She got up and left, and you actually said, hey, where are you going? Whatever. She... She yeah. Left. It was oh, yeah, that one girl. And he didn't do a thing. He stayed there and was laughing. He was yeah. laughing at it. He was he like, ah! And look, and then his phone was off on the side. Hey. And he kept ringing, and we're all, te- we're all like hitting each other. Look, 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 his phone. Oh, girl, call him. Call him. <laughs> he was not even paying attention. He was just That's yeah. how you San know Diego, you. San Diego, this nigga was, he didn't move, did, after five minutes. I said, nigga, you better go get your bitch. <laughs> he got up and left. He was like, I'm going to go get up. Uh, go oh, get. my God. That's, hey, that, that's how you know you're touching people's souls. That's real comedy right there, man. 
Hey man, and it ain't Even like I'm talking to them. I'm just talking. Right, right. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. How do you let some stranger get you that upset? I'm not saying racist shit. Right, right. I'm not saying I'm not calling out no one person in particular. I'm talking about the dick pussy game. Right, right. This you, is how it go. You remember the first joke you wrote that you saw it resonate like that? Where you was like, damn, I'm on to some this is I'm on to something. Nigga. I mean, when I first started talking about my life, I had been doing comedy for a while, and then I was in a situation with this uh, girl, and um, I just started talking about that shit, and this is what got me my TV deal. Right, right. Because I was living in the house that she bought with this other nigga. That nigga <laughs> dreamed he had a baby with her. Wait, they had two kids, and um, mm. basically when he used to pick up the kids and shit, I'd be over there on the couch. Oh. Oh my God. Hey, what's up, dude? Hey, oh my God. Hey, no, were you younger? Were you, <laughs> were you younger than him? Yeah, I was way I was younger. Of course. I was way younger, but man. I used to look like, man, that nigga bought this house with this bitch. Man. And basically, they lasted about six years, and he had to get the fuck out, oh. pay her. Right. His life was destroyed. Yeah. You were Derek Fisher. You could see. Right. You were Derek, <laughs> you were Derek Fisher. The backup point guard starting now. That's I was good. 20. I, I just used to live there and get up and hoop every day and shit. I, you, you know what I, tripped me out about that? It's crazy, I think, how women will require so much of one nigga and then not of the next nigga. Like, right. you're 20, not really bringing nothing to the table, but Dick. I was I was fucking yeah. off potential. She knew I was funny though. Right, right. That bitch met me at the comedy club. Right, right. And I was one of the best comedians. Uh-huh. So she eventually took me from my bitch I had because I was a young <laughs> nigga right. and I was stupid. I was like, oh, this bitch got all this. You right. see what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Oh my God. Mm. She know who she is. Uh-oh. <laughs> she know who she is. God damn it, move me out there from Chicago to Dalton. Back when Dalton was a nice suburb. <laughs> older woman, I'm imagining. Older she, woman, she wait, was no, older than me. I'm imagining she looks like the Popeyes chicken lady. <laughs> I can the see Popeyes that. The Popeyes chicken lady, not really, but no. she was her body. Even Crazy. though she had, she ain't had no big titties. Right. But her shape was Crazy. real voluptuous, and I was so mad because I went to Def Comedy Jam, and my nigga, rest his soul, Ricky Harris, and. And uh, 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 Jamie Foxx, back when he was um, fucking with bitches, uh, <laughs> they was all looking at her like, and, and, you know, they didn't give a fuck about me. I was a little young nigga. Right, right. Who the fuck is this nigga? Who is that she with? Because her body made us stand out. Right. I was so mad when she was like, guys always do that to me. I was like, you bitch, you got a nice body. <laughs> you look like you supposed to be with me, bitch. Oh. <laughs> Your face yeah, and titties yeah. flat, goddamn. Oh, but her body? Crazy. Oh, yeah. Stand yeah. out. Hell yeah. You know how it go. Oh, yeah. I know you know how get a go. pretty fat bitch or a real oh, cold, yeah. ugly bitch. Hell yeah. When you ain't got that paper. Hell yeah. You ain't got that paper, you're going to get a pretty fat bitch. Yeah. Or a bitch with a nice body and a goofy face. <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. Two traits at the most. Right. Yeah, we ain't got no paper. Yeah. That pussy was platinum too, goddammit. Yeah. She, she got bumped, though. Same thing. With yeah. me, some nigga took it from me and shit. Yeah, some <laughs> some younger. some Jamaican singer nigga. Oh, he used yeah. to always go down there and go see. Uh, his name was Fire Marshal. <laughs> yeah, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> some nigga from I the north that. side no, used no, to be no, down there. I, I shot the shady <laughs> ass nigga. Oh yeah, crazy. That nigga was putting it on that bitch, but I knew the bitch wasn't shit because she used to go down there all the time. Right, right, right. I wasn't trying to fuck up my career. I ain't stupid. Right. I oh, been yeah. knew you was fucking him. <laughs> <laughs> Re- regular looking women, them is the best ones on the come up, man. I oh, got yeah. I got a few. Shout out to all y'all out there. Uh-oh, yeah. they, don't they, they keep me afloat. You Hold know a nigga saying? down till it happen for him, hey, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Real talk. <laughs> are you a holding nigga down till it happen for him, bitch? You know who you are. Hell yeah. You know exactly. If you ain't never been to my house, you one of them. You hold me down. That shit just remind me of this movie I saw, man. What was the name of that movie where Queen Latifah was the love interest? She produced the movie. That shit had <laughs> oh. me rolling. She was the love interest of a man? Yeah. Well, it was really- <laughs> a comic. <laughs> and at the end of the movie, uh, he chose her over Paula Patton. I was oh, in that movie dying. Yeah. I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> she was the friend or something, right? What she was, was the friend, friend, the good friend, and uh, all that shit. Right. 
right. Paula Patton was the bad bitch who always had a life and all these <laughs> things. What was that movie? That was actually end, really good, though. I don't remember end, it. Comet it. came back to her. <laughs> <laughs> it was Comet. Okay, I think I Comet remember. Comet was the actor. Yeah, oh, wow. I was like, yeah, yeah. Queen Latifah. I yeah, can tell yeah, you. Yeah. Latifah, you produced this movie. Oh, yeah. Oh, she, <laughs> it was she, good. She that built was a like good movie, though. That was funny than a motherfucker. She was a trainer. Yeah, I think I, I remember the right. movie, but I didn't see it. I'm a fan of Latifah, though. But Me you know, too. I'm yeah. a fan of Latifah too. Yeah. Goddamn it! But ain't no motherfucker gonna choose uh, you over Paula Patton. I don't yeah. give a fucking Paula Patton gang banging yeah. in the streets. Not you with that what? John Madden <laughs> body you got. Right. <laughs> 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 she said she, she get just right. I think yeah. that's the name of the movie. Oh, okay. okay. Just yeah. right, goddamn it! Ain't but. nobody picking <laughs> Latifah over Paula Hell Patton. No. Hell no! I don't <laughs> give a fuck if that bitch got HIV. Goddamn it! I'm wearing rubbers in night. Believe me, she don't want. Tifa she don't like want no what? She don't want none of you guys. No, I know, like, I know Paula she is. Paula Patton to go. That's why she left the old boy. The little like the motherfucker. What's his name? The singer with the. Uh, Y'all got the sweet yeah, taste of love. Yeah, now new girl yeah. pregnant. You got something sweet. <laughs> Robin Thicke. Robin, Robin Thicke. Thicke. That, that, yeah. that shit lasts a little while. All them motherfuckers with the fake voices. Hey Paula, I love you, baby. <laughs> he they nice fuck voice. with him for a little while and yeah. shit. Then after a while, they be like, "Fuck this soft motherfucker." For real, they. Yeah. I got the sweet taste of love. No, they were together since they were in high school. Do Latifa hide that she like girls? I mean, because that's obvious. Yeah, yeah. L-A-T. I mean, Not Latifa. that she hides it. She just never has huh. She can't just publicly it. say it. Yeah. That'll fuck people money up. Everybody who fuck with the same sex. Right, right, right. Like, they'll talk yeah. all that. Oh, I'm down with this. I'm down with that. But you ain't about to let motherfuckers know you sucking that pussy <laughs> from the Gosh, back. Oh, my God. You ain't Ellen. <laughs> Ellen, the only motherfucker let it be known. I'm yeah. sucking pussy from the back. I fuck with she Ellen, though. She right out and did that, y'all. Yep. She yeah. made a move. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah, these dyke bitches out here ain't let <laughs> motherfuckers know that guy. they got that motherfucking welches on their motherfucking <laughs> mouth, goddammit. <laughs> goddammit. What's up, Oprah? Yeah. You know you suck that oh, pussy. Stop. Yeah. You know you <laughs> suck <laughs> that pussy, Oprah. Who else? Shit, I was about All to them? Yeah, for the, any, any bra that can rap is, is sucking on some pussy. <laughs> uh, Old any bra with a jump day. shot? Any bra oh. with a jump shot? Sucking on some pussy. All, all uh, WNBA bitches oh, sucking yeah, pussy? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. oh yeah. For yeah. sure. Hell, yeah. I would say about 90%. About 90%. Yeah. Oh, in yeah. the locker room, got them. Yeah, they ain't fucking with them. With a gym sock on their motherfucking uh, womb. All that contact they be having with each other over the years, they start believing that's what they supposed to be doing, I guess. I don't know. Uh, I don't, hell yeah. I don't yeah, know what dude. it is. What about what about the female um, singers? <laughs> <laughs> shit, who, who you thinking? I don't know. I'm trying to think. R&B singers? All of them. Man. Yeah. Who yeah. don't suck puts? Hey, you right. Oh. God I don't see nothing wrong with it, ladies. Ladies, you do. Ladies don't. Guys don't. Go and yeah. suck that pussy, goddammit. I ain't gonna hold it against you, goddammit, until yeah. I get mad at you and I, uh, your, <laughs> you and the kids the around. <laughs> Tell your daughter how you be sucking that <laughs> pussy, though. <laughs> oh, yeah. Just don't get mad when I walk up to you and your girl and ask you if y'all got a girl or a boyfriend. My bad. That's my favorite line. Y'all got a boyfriend? <laughs> they be wanting a boyfriend. Hey, hell yeah. <laughs> Do you think all women done took dick before? I'm talking about the dyke bitches. I think 90% of them. And that's yeah. probably why they said I don't, I don't, want, I don't like it. Well, There's some bad dick. No, I don't know. I'm just saying. How can you have it? Most gay guys don't really go with a woman and then decide. But I think it's the opposite with the females. With females, they try dick. I think so. They go then. The ones that I know. Right. Like, mm. The ones you know. Don't you know gay people, Corey? No. My God. Oh, stop. <laughs> Who gay I know? You zip flames dress up. <laughs> 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 Flame is beyond no, gay. No, but I'm just saying he act like it's a bad thing. You can know gay yeah. people don't make you get goodness. You sake. hang with them, no D. I don't hang with them. I know people that, yeah. You don't hang with gay people. I know people. I have clients that are gay. I have a lot of gay right. guys and girls that take my classes. You don't hang with them? You don't no. go out with them? No, but if I did so well, what's what? wrong with going out with them, D? That's what I'm saying. What's wrong with that? I'm not all scare rad like If you. you're a woman and you're taking any type of penetration, I don't consider you gay. Really? What if the bitch is strapping on fucking? I mean, it's, if it's if you're taking a fake dick, it's still some form of a dick. You you so like plastic dick, oh, dick count for saying, dick? Oh, so you're nah, saying? Nah, I don't count for dick, but it's a form of dick. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like comparing street ball to that NBA ball. That ain't fair. You fucking a plastic dick, bitch. You ain't got the white ball. <laughs> that ain't real. No, nah, it ain't real. No. <laughs> you say you ain't got. You ain't got the got white ball. God damn it. Uh, I see what you're saying. So you're saying because they're not being penetrated by an actual body part, a real body part. 
Right. Like a woman would they with a man. They seek penetration. What? They seek They seek a penetration. penetration, yeah. Just like girls, sometimes when you eat pussy and you put the finger in there, you can tell they want you to, goddammit. Oh. <laughs> they start wiggling. Be like, yeah, I know, oh. bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Might be because you just don't know what you're doing. Right. Maybe oh, that too, wow. goddammit. Whatever, goddammit. I'm about to go home when I'm through. I tell you that much. <laughs> I'm about to go smooth. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, I, I think that. You know they got a gay bomb, nigga? What's a gay bomb? You know, they got chemicals they put they can put in a bomb and blow up and it'll make the men on the battlefield start thinking a different way. They done done that shit already. Yeah, out here yeah, in yeah. LA yeah, DC. Yeah, yeah, hell in Atlanta. yeah. Atlanta. They dropped a gay bomb right by that Houston. <laughs> <in Atlanta>. <laughs> <laughs> right at Lennox Mall. They was yeah. like, yeah, yeah. Who wants some sweet tea? <laughs> <laughs> they gonna drop it at the All Star Weekend. Yeah. All Star Weekend out here this year. In two weeks, it's gonna be. Hey, cracking. this is what I'm finna do. I'm gonna be walking around All Star Weekend selling t shirts. Oh. How about that? Looking like I ain't on shit. I'm going to be selling t-shirts all the time. We can walk around. I got a special cart I bought. Look for the Corey Holcomb cart. I'm going to be pushing it around the city. Oh, I love it. I'm going to get a peddler's license. I got to buy a peddler's license. Yeah. Mm, wow. You're going to sell it outside. Yeah, that's you're going to make some bread. I know I'm going to make some bread because yeah. my t-shirt's funny. Hey, hell yeah. Yeah, you're going to make bread. I got some special t-shirts. You talking all around LA Live? All around L.A. Live or wherever. For anybody who's never cracking. been to Los Angeles, it's just a whole area downtown, yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. police yeah. going to try to make me move, and I'm going to be like, I have a peddler's license. <laughs> <laughs> My boy be out there with a saxophone making money. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he should hook up with that dude. Be on the wow. homeless musician type. Nah, nah, he, nah, he ain't homeless. I know he ain't homeless. Yeah. I'm just looking like he looked like he's homeless. <laughs> no. That's how he get that paper. Like he be out there in Jordans. and He, he be boys in. Yeah, hell yeah. He be out there every weekend. That's what's up. He'd make two, three hundred a day doing that shit. Damn, I'm yeah. trying to make like motherfucking, I'm going to count it off. I'm going to videotape the whole weekend to be, because I'm telling you, I bought a cart that I'm going to push around that it's, it's going to be tricked out at anything. And what well, you got to do is you you put it on social media so then they can follow you and find out exactly where you're at. Like the food app? trucks. Like the oh, food yeah, trucks. That's, yeah, that's dumb. Yeah. What is that? What, what kind of app is that? I don't know, but we can find out. Okay. But, you know, a lot of my friends do that with their food trucks so that people can find out exactly, pinpoint where they're at and go, okay, I'm coming up. Hmm. Taco truck? <laughs> yeah, you finna no, kill. No, grilled cheese. Oh, you gonna murder. I'm gonna murder for real. Yeah. yeah you gonna murder with that. That's God damn it, and I'm filming it. I oh. want it to be a documentary, God damn it, because I don't believe no motherfucker supposed to be broke. I'm about to motherfucker find out how much money I can make on the motherfucking streets NBA All-Star Weekend. I would've went to Minnesota to the Super Bowl, but God damn it, it's too cold. Yeah, that's Even shit. though it wasn't cold ah. that weekend. <laughs> The one that you could have had a mobile like the Pope Mobile, all enclosed, a little heat uh -huh, air. Get the see fuck through out of here. Your <laughs> this motherfucker go throw some tar in that motherfucker. <laughs> fuck you, Pope. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. No, the last one, the last tu the tour he was going on, or the little, you know, the little. Yeah, that little. Um... No, you didn't see that a guy, a cop, the horse went crazy, and, the, and it went up like this, and a cop fell off his horse, so the Pope got, they were all panicked. He jumped out of his car to go see if he was okay. Hmm. On the, uh, he jumped out of the car he to go see the cop? He jumped out of the Pope mobile to make sure that the guy on the floor was all right. The he Pope jumped like, yes. Oh, wow. He was like, bless you. Old boy no, was like, I'm atheist, bitch. Get the <laughs> fuck off me. <laughs> no, fucking. he was happy. Oh, wow. Yeah, That's the crazy. horse went up like this, yes, and the guy just flew off. <laughs> hey, the name of that bomb is called the Hellacious Bomb. Google it. say Corey pushing his hood mall cart around. <laughs> <laughs> hood mall cart. You got to get Put you. a backpack out for... Uh, fuck y'all, nigga. Hell yeah. I ain't going to have no snacks for sale. But oh. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what somebody said? <laughs> hey, if you set up a little uh, sh a stage and a mic. Maybe I get a little stage and a mic. Hell yeah, you, you'll make a killing. Oh, you probably sell about two, three hundred. There goes. There you go. <laughs> what? Hell yeah. Your, what is that thing you have? The, uh, the ladder? Bullhorn. Oh, I got I got a new one oh. in the car. Man. That's yeah, hilarious. You're going to make a killing with that. Hell yeah. God damn. I'm going to hook you up with the saxophone, nigga. <laughs> Do that. We yeah, stand outside. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Does he have a street license? I don't know. Oh. We'll don't figure know. it out. Yeah, he'd mm -hmm. be there every every Laker game, every Clipper game. He'd be out. He'd be outside. Some my motherfucker gagging on my haircut. I ain't get my. I don't even know how my hair look. I've been out all day like this. I'm. Hey, that's I, I I didn't even look. This jogging suit was in my car. Look how I threw it on right for the show because it's hot in L.A. during the day. Oh, man. Yeah. I had on flip-flops. Me too. I didn't I even, had, I had to buy yeah. some socks. I had these on. Yeah, no cold socks later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, 
I was in motherfucking. I yeah. walk around hot to the motherfucking LA. It was warm. What did it get? Eighty. Two, it was hot during the what? day, but like at about four o'clock, that wind Boom. be like, ha ha! Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm thinking what you got yeah. to cut kind of put on. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, you're so right. Somebody said I look like Jim Brown. Fuck y'all. Mm. Nah. Somebody said my comb called in sick. Fuck yeah. y'all, nigga. Oh, I got my Hell Panther yeah. tickets. Well, all right, D, come on with it. We're going to do this all segment right. of the show that mm. nobody is ever willing to sponsor. Hell yeah. Excuse me, I might be the first one to sponsor, not you. Okay. Mm-hmm. These loose talk about bullshit. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Oh, what was that? This is the night. No, I felt something come off of it. Oh, shit. Anyway, all right. Yeah, uh, you did bring up Super Bowl. Uh, you know that loads of stories that happened around Super Bowl. We already spoke about Kevin Hart, so let's move on. Okay. Uh, the other story that uh, was picking up on Super Bowl Sunday was um, Bill Belichick benching Malcolm Butler. <laughs> now, so, that's why they lost. That nigga was crying. Uh, did you hear why? No. Why? All right. Somebody Be- was fucking his bitch. Hold and he on. Go home. Hold on. <laughs> I gotta play the game. Word <laughs> was all right. Word, <laughs> word was because of practice and rule infractions. Even though he'd been in and out of the hospital with flu type symptoms, he also had a very rough week at practice. But others are saying that the the, the straw that that broke the camel's back was when he attended the Rick Ross concert on Thursday oh. that resulted in him breaking curfew pretty late that night. So on Sunday game day was when he found out he would not be playing. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. That nigga was crying. That's was him. It? Yeah. And that's, that's actually, the nigga that won the Super Bowl for pic- them yeah. when they beat Seattle. Well, that's what I'm saying. That, see, that's kind of a weird twist there. And then that picture on the bottom left at the Rick Ross concert was actually posted by him on Instagram. Oh, he snitched on himself, <laughs> man. Nobody uh, actually broke curfew, too, so it was bad. He didn't come in on time, yeah. They grown. Yeah, yeah that's crazy, yeah, But man. there are certain things, rules that they have. On Fuck stuff that, like I'm that. grown. Straight up. Even with the sports, when you are signed to certain contracts, there's sports and stuff you can't even play. You can't enjoy on your time off. Baseball players, football players, all that. You can't do skydiving. You can't go surfing. You can't go. There's certain things you can't even. We all individuals, in. but I'm here to tell you guys. They sign contracts, though. So. When you see me crying, some fucked up shit happens. If I'm getting paid, God damn it, I'll be like, oh, I ain't playing? Oh, all right. right now. Yeah. Man, it's fucked up. Can you me. now? Because now he can, say, he can say that they probably lost. Look, I, I, I'd have helped. You know what I'm saying? Well, he right. said he, said he, gonna, he would have made plays out there. There you go. That was a terrible move on his part, man. You should, what, yeah. to go see Rick Ross? Nigga, Rick Ross is the <laughs> shit. <laughs> to, put, to post the video. He know the rules. Uh, he shouldn't have posted that video. Curfew. Oh, yeah, no. Curfew. <laughs> 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 what? He said he curfew. Curfew. <laughs> She broke her. <laughs> she her That's, That's fucked up. up. But look, that picture is an actual real picture, a, a screenshot of the teammates consoling him when they, he got the news. They showed that shit on the motherfucking That's game. True, they showed yeah. him crying and yeah. shit. They was like, get the nigga crying. Oh. Damn, before I hit it. I got him. Damn. They wouldn't have did that to Brady. No, hell oh, no. Oh, hell it no. Was, yeah. Brady is great for crying. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's, mm-hmm. His heart and his passion is, he's a great is in it. He didn't go because he was fucking Donald Trump in the ass. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. All right, moving on. Uh, Rest in peace, Dennis Edwards, uh, 74. And if you guys aren't familiar with who Dennis Edwards is, he was in The Temptations. He was one of the lead singers. A couple of songs he was uh, known for was Papa Was a Rolling Stone. Oh, okay. I Can't Get Next to You and Cloud Nine, all that. Anyway, uh, no, that's Jill Scott. Oh. That was Jill Scott? Yes, that's (laughs) a story I have coming up. Oh, rest in peace. Hold on, that's another story I can look up, oh, Frank. Anyway, re- anyway, so Who is that nigga? That that's nigga. Dennis Edwards of the Temptations. Now, rest in peace. Like I said, he passed that's away last wife. week. Hold on, he passed away last week. But just when lots of his fans were trying to express their condolences, they find out something else. They were stunned to hear that his 60-year-old wife Brenda Should've had good. been under investigation for alleged abuse to him. The Chicago police reports revealed that weeks earlier, uh, she had been ordered to stay away from him. You bitch! (laughs) After an adult protective services investigator visited their home. The report said that she was accused of allegedly abusing him a week before his death by attempting to suffocate him face down. He was on his bed. Was when he handicapped or something? That dick wasn't working no more. I already know no, who that was. So anyway, they, she, was a, she attempted to suffocate him and that she kept. My then, dick erections are gone. <laughs> Shoe bop. 
<laughs> this motherfucker just won't get on bone. That's fucked up. That's I messed said up. That. That's so it bad. is. Take that back. Anyway, so um, when he dies. <laughs> so not only that they say she uh, allegedly attempted to suffocate him, she also they found out kept the bound and immobile. So he was bound to the bed and immobile anyway, even if he wasn't bound, that she kept his hearing aids away from him. Oh, she was going hard. But that's common. <laughs> yeah. Bitches who be with these older motherfuckers who chose a younger bitch. Right. They 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 be so frustrated with the motherfucker. That's right. messed up. See, well, that's what happens when you marry like that. No, too that's young. what happens when you get old and you still want a bitch that you feel like is cute rather than a bitch that's down for you. Right. Because you ain't gonna be to be around no bitch like that. But look how sexist that is, though, because they let her do a whole lot of shit. No, and she still was, run the street. Yeah, yeah. Let them know, know you <laughs> tried to smother your bitch. Oh, you! I'll be in okay. jail right now. Yeah. Yeah. Well, she wasn't supposed Funky to be there. Funky bitch. So when they found out, they they. What's you the know. bitch name? Brenda. Expose the bitch her name. Is Brenda. That's all. Over Brenda, Brenda what? Knows. Well, the Edwards. Brenda the smuggler? She was, she was married to. Stop. <laughs> anyway. Um, Funky ass bitch. They said that the order was officially dropped since he ended up passing away before the, because they had already, po- uh, how you say, um, pressed. Right. The, the charge against the, the order. The fuck said silent night. That's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, she is, she is still, Yo, shit. she is still denying the allegations, but the order, ain't shit bitch. but the order was officially dropped because it had mm. never even came to fruition. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Like yeah. they had processed it. And All you old niggas, dying. man, don't fuck with these young hoes, man. You no. can't keep Tell up you. with these young hoes. And I'm talking about some of the greatest old players mm-hmm. yeah. wind up falling off later on in life trying to keep up with a little young bitch. Yeah. Mm. Or a bitch that's like 15, 20 years younger than them. Get the fuck out of here. You better get the fuck away from that bitch. That she, bitch ain't yeah. shit. She that bitch finna be fuck. Omarosa killed that nigga, if you ask me. <laughs> killed that nigga. I, that nigga was healthy than a motherfucker. Who was Rainbow. she with? Oh, okay, Remember yeah. She was murdered, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. How that nigga die? I don't know how he, he was died. In the hospital. That nigga was on top of his shit, dog. Got around that bitch and died. You know what? I'm yeah, just he used to saying. work out every day. That's I know what I'm saying. Old, yeah. Wow. This wasn't no old decrepit ass nigga. No, you got right. up under that bitch was gone. She should have took murder classes from Mama Rosen. That's what she probably did. Yeah, now nah, them hoes <laughs> naturally evil, man, and don't nobody call them hoes out. Bitch tried to. If a bitch is caught trying to motherfucking smother a motherfucker, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. What the yeah. fuck is you talking about? Well, that's why they said they pressed her. They 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 had everything ongoing. It was ongoing. She was supposed to stay away from it. She did, but he ended up dying a week later. So the the stuff don't that breathe they had, any further. So the stuff <laughs> that they had on her was dropped because it was like, oh, okay, because you know what I'm saying. Like yeah. the, the thing was just for her to stay away from him. He has well, children. So he reported. He reported that she. No, no, no. no. Oh. It, it, they had when you're sick like that. And, and someone's taking care of him. They have people coming and taking. Plus, he has older, grown children. They haven't right. given all the details as Where to why. Where the fuck why. was his kids at? Some motherfuckers well, talk about Viagra. Thing. Viagra, if it worked for you, that's a blessing. But Viagra don't work for motherfuckers. But the truth is, it's yeah. a blessing when Viagra don't work because then you won't take it. Right. When Viagra work, that's you true. take it. You be like, fuck that. I'm about to fuck shit off this. That's there. true. <laughs> right. <laughs> Give me 20 minutes. Yeah, that's messed up. That that's is messed up. It's very that's sad. Any rest in peace for real. God, Any water in there? Yeah, there's Thirsty some water in there. Thirsty motherfucking, um... Grab Corey. Hyena, goddamn it. Stop. Uh, moving on. Um, so... If you look out for me, good people, I, I, I really appreciate y'all. Ain't no bottle of water in that motherfucker? Yes, there is. There's Give me a, a bottle of water. Legitimately, goddamn it, with the blue... <laughs> stretch <laughs> pads <laughs> on, goddamn it. She's laughing. So, and moving on. So, Toy Link Kelly. <laughs> Who? This Toy Link Kelly. Kelly. Oh, okay. Thank you. She yeah. is. Thank uh, you. Well, Thank she, you. She, it says she is. She is uh, Suge Knight's fiance. She was just given on Friday three years in jail. She was found guilty of violating a probation that she had already been placed on her by contacting Suge Knight. Also, for her connection, they found out in selling the video footage that nothing, it wasn't supposed to be released from that other incident. What other she, incident? His incident, an incident that happened. She sold it, apparently, they found out, uh, for 55000 to TMZ. Well, goddamn it, she's trying to get her paper. No, she was already on probation. They told her she, that's part of, part of the deal was she was not to have anything to do with any releases, any information to the press. So they found her guilty for that. Um, what footage was it? Yeah. Uh, it didn't say. It just said that she was found guilty of selling some stuff. In other words, she was already on probation. So whatever she was on probation for, she broke it. They said she wasn't supposed to contact them. She did. 
Then they said they found out that uh, allegedly, I think, I don't know if this one's been cleared, that she was paying other inmates to let Suge use their cell phones to call her. So she was not supposed to have any communication with him. Right. She was already on probation for that. So the deal was don't contact him. And she did. And they just gave her three years. Wow. Yeah. So I'm here to tell you, man, I got a homeboy in Chicago. I always tell motherfuckers the feds gave her all this information to turn her against her husband. Mm. Right. They, they had the other cell phone info. They showed other women he was fuck with everything. Mm. She did not fucking say shit and cooperate with the feds against her husband. So they, they arrested. put her in yeah, jail. They'll wow. do that. They love putting motherfucking black women in jail. But old boy who stole all them people money. Mm. Right. You know, the white dude. Made off. Mm, made off. Yeah, oh. His wife didn't go to jail. Nah, not mm-hmm. at all. His wife didn't go to jail. <laughs> I can't believe that. And they claim that, that she didn't have to. His wife privilege. Yeah, institutional oh, yeah. They didn't even <laughs> come at her. They were still saying, yes, Miss Nato, he's going. But oh. you're not, even though you got all this shit from him and that helped is. him. You see mm-hmm. an accessory like a mo- Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. So anyway. They throw your black ass in jail. If you, I'm telling you, I don't give a mm-hmm. fuck what it is. God damn it. Did you jaywalk? Uh-oh. This <laughs> comic used to have a joke about the motherfucker get pulled over and shit. They look in the back and shit and be looking at the kids. Let me see that Power Ranger. Oh. Give me that. Oh. I'm going to check the serial number on her. <laughs> <laughs> that's even Power stolen. That's, <laughs> that's what they do when you yeah. black. Hell yeah. Oh, my God. That's anyway, okay, up. moving on. Uh, so Jill Scott. I love me some Jill Scott. Anyway, um. This got to do with some dick pussy, right? Yeah. I already know. Sort of, I guess. Jill anyway, won't that she, yeah. she, she requested a gag order against her ex. Sucking your dick like it's golden. <laughs> That's Jill Scott's son. She requested, Who's her ex? She requested a restraining order against, uh, she claims, against her husband, Michael Dobson. Um, they, she claims that he's engaged in a campaign of harassment and disparagement. Um, and that. He that, tells the truth. She said the end game is that he's trying to squeeze money out of her. Um, he went and did an interview. See how she look on the side of that hair? Right. You know what? That is not an actual picture of her looking at him. So on you know the Angie Mama side of the hair. Stop it. Yeah. I'm a Jill Scott. But it was wrong because look, pseudo. he she really like did Optimus do it. Oh, he did man. do an interview where he called her an evil woman and threatened to fight dirty. So she does have that proof. Um, he wasn't gonna win. His girl make more money than him. So How do we? I don't know. We never don't know this, win. though. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, she um, she filed to end their 19th month marriage. She says money seems to be his end game, citing that she has business accounts. He, Hell yeah, money his end game. Look at you. <laughs> she, she got a cold too. body though. When, when she got that weight right, her body cold as a mother. She looks like Optimus Prime. <laughs> you know what? Stop. All big head. <laughs> Regular people legs. Uh, uh, hey. you, I ain't I never was, seen her up. You seen her in person? I, I, see, I, I saw her at this award show with her pants tucked in. I was like, no! <laughs> no! She got that triangle uh, apple body. Yeah, uh, yeah. Anyway, the judge did the judge did issue the order, so she got it. So she got up out that marriage, got that. Well, no, or issued the gag order, so he's well, not he supposed tell. to say anything. But he, he already did. Look, he already did interviews like he that. He looked same. way oh, he looked way older than her. He old Satcho Page looking you know, nigga. You really <laughs> look yeah. at her. She look well, how old is uh, Jill Scott? About forty. She looks like a lunchroom lady in that picture. <laughs> but that say. nigga look you like you don't the need tem- no gravy, young man. <laughs> you suck. young man, you eat the broccoli. <laughs> he looked like the the Temptations nigga that just died. Kinda. Like he Malik does. Yoba um, <laughs> roommate in this bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let me put this New York under the cover, nigga. That nigga like the Merrick Kingston looking ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> they look like a good couple though. Like together, people be like, "Oh, y'all together? That look right." That yeah, look right. right. <laughs> no, that's messed up though. How I, mean, I don't wish Scott? any ill on anybody's marriage. That's terrible. But I mean, you can't go, you can't go around talking like that. No, you not at go all. Go around talking like what? Doing bashing people and saying that. What did, they, what doing, did he say about it? When you're going through a divorce, he no. said that evil and that she's doing. He said she's bashing him. She told him that he needed to stop talking bad about. Wait, her. wait. He called her evil, and that's that's what's wrong with that. Well, I don't know what else. How he many husbands him. she didn't have? She, no, she at least interview, on three. Interview, interview, saying that. Not like he just out there running his mouth saying that. This got to be her third. No, I don't know. Cause she was with a nigga when she came in the game. She was and married. And she already has a boy, a baby, right? Right. Time, I think. She yeah. left. One of the husbands to fuck one of the motherfuckers she was on the road with. Right. I'm guessing three. <laughs> really? That puts it in the street, goddamn. <laughs> it's in them neo soul streets. Yeah, for real. 
And then the last thing really is loose talk about Jill bullshit. gonna suck on you. Jill gonna suck on you. Jill gonna suck on you. I don't know what you guys think of this. I just wanted to get your comment or your take on this. But this mother of three. They say she looks like she do Popeye's commercial. She kind of does look like a lady. Anyway, there's a woman out there, right? Her name's Diana Ringo. Um, mm. And she's a mother of uh, three. She had twins last. And when she had her twins, she claimed um, she has, she's going to do whatever it takes to maintain her. Get this, because this is kind of gross. Uh, it, not kind of, it is. Maintain her 18-inch waist after she ended up losing to her, her curves, giving birth to her twins. Oh, she says, no. She says she never takes it off. Not even during sex. She said the only time she takes it off is to shower. Oh, no. Nah, that shit look retarded. That, that pussy stank like a motherfucker. That sweat be dropping down. What state she live in? I hope she don't live in Florida wearing that motherfucker. Her pussy be wet, but it's from sweat dropping. <laughs> what? That is so Her pussy stay wet. It's sweaty. Uh, she says she wears it Foot 23, pussy 23 hours, and she only takes it off to shower and sometimes for workouts, and she Get never loses it. On. She She's 5'2". Oh, She's, she a runt? She's small. She's oh, married bitch. to a Navy officer, Brett. And you know who Brett is, Brett White. 33. Elaine. <laughs> so, While he be gone, motherfuckers be uh, cutting the back out there, little motherfucker. Yeah. What they call that thing? What? What thing? A thodacy belt. Oh, a chastity. Chastity oh, belt. Yeah. Chastity, chastity belt. you silly. Nasty pussy belt. I don't get it. So <laughs> instead of losing the 77 pounds, the five and a half, uh, uh, two inch, uh, Diana said that she'd rather put that on. So she says she has a balanced diet and a little exercise, but she said she decides to just rather wear the waist pinching corset that instead. Shit. What's, what's that called when people be having that disorder where they be fucking their bodies up? Dysmorphia? And she said she don't care. Yes, body dysmorphia. She said yeah. she don't care. She said she walks around and people look at her and she could tell they're making fun of her and everything, even with her boys. But you goddamn right. She said goddamn she don't care. Look, that looks crazy. That shit with your kid. Look at this bitch look stupid in the motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> My kids always be like that. <laughs> That's what she said. She said, the one thing I do notice all the time is that people walking towards me and they immediately look down at themselves. And Oh, this is what she said. This is what she found. Just, she justifies it. She said, people immediately look down at themselves and their bellies. Um, yeah, it don't matter, bitch. Your, <laughs> belly is, your, your belly and shit has been forced awkwardly to look that way. God damn it. That's well, you know, they say, they say that uh, they, they, those were worn by historians, you know, back in the day in the, in the uh, Victorian exactly. name. I thought right. in some Asians, they, they break your feet so your feet don't they can get do big. That too. Ain't what no mean? Bigfoot bitches. They break the bitches' foot and toes and just, shit. Just so it don't grow right. Yeah, yeah that's just great. Bitch, I'll bust your foot, you grow another. <laughs> you wear a size eight. Get my, my helmet. <laughs> I'm going to make the bitches. I wish that foot no, would they grow do. They, they keep them in smaller shoes so that it just kind of knuckles up. The wood shoes, the, the cranky. But they do <laughs> have dangers of waist training. In case those that are actually thinking of doing this, they say it diminishes lung capacity, your rib cages, it deforms them, it can go into your organs, the liver it pushes the liver down, elongating it, squeezing it against your ribs, your back, everything. So they said uh, it's not a good move, just uh, exercise. <laughs> Who's so, attracted to that? That's crazy. Yeah, I and her husband in the other pictures, I didn't have yeah. a, a time for she all of them. Like, that oh, he's baby, that look it. cute. That look cute. <laughs> <laughs> that shit look retarded. He said man. whatever makes Get your her aunt happy. body ass out of here, bitch. <laughs> he said whatever makes yeah, her yeah, happy. <laughs> anyway, oh my god. So, that's, that's, that's that. That's fucked yeah, up. That's yeah, messed yeah. up. Fucked your life up. Does she that actually looked cool. decent in the regular picture. That's what I'm saying. Look, that's what I'm saying. That's how she originally looked after having the baby. She looked like a bitch that you would buy one drink. After that, you'd be like, well, you fucking something. I'll buy you another drink. You got to fuck something. right there on the right, right? Man. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, After I'll having the out. twins, yeah, she looks good. But no, she wanted to look like that on the left. I wonder what set her off. What she, what did she see to be like? This is how I got to do it from now on. Yeah, that looks wild. Ain't nobody validating that. Ain't no nigga trying heart. to highlight her. Mm. Mm. No real motherfucker. Mm. Mm. Hell no. Motherfucker gonna tell her, bitch, what's wrong with you? Straight. Up. <laughs> well, 18 inches. And do you know how much 18 inches is like? It's like. It's, yeah, that's my neck. My neck is 18 and. Then, well, yeah, that's, See? that's small. See? For a uh, waist? Like, yeah. Like, Hell yeah, I know what 18 <laughs> inches. No, I'm just fucking uh, with you. <laughs> that nigga crazy. Oh, oh, yeah, man. I know what 20 inches look like. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> bless her heart. I don't know. She's fine with it. She knows so. I don't know. I just thought that was crazy. When I, saw, I was like, boy, people are just doing way too much to themselves. Stupid bitch. 
Yeah. Anyway. All right. Um, yeah, that's so crazy. We're going to go and get the break in early now, goddammit. Because uh, I got the piss. Uh-oh. And yeah. uh, we shall return 50 motherfucking 150, nigga. <laughs> Why not? Put her belt is a little dog leash. Routine, business as usual. In, out, hello, goodbye, and that's all there is to it.
me after. Yeah. 51 motherfucking 50 in the house. Always coming up with new ideas, trying to do um, new shit. This is, a, this is a new segment of the show. Don't nobody know about it but me because exactly, I thought of it. Exactly, because he didn't even tell us. I'm like, what is going on here? God damn it. We about to do some improv, god damn it, to show how talented we are. Uh-oh. Why This not? is what they use on set, god damn it. Uh-oh. Motherfucker. And I'm about to motherfucker come up with some shit where I'm expecting right everybody to do what the fuck they supposed to do. All right. Like, for example, roll. Uh, nothing disgusting. Nothing. Shut up. Dead. <laughs> Scene. One. Walk. Slate. Walk in on wife. <laughs> Take one. Director. <laughs> Corey. 5150. Camera 5150 camera. So the scene is you walking in on your wife cheating? No, the scene is you walking in on your wife cheating. <laughs> <laughs> you come up with one for me after this. <laughs> right, oh, right. oh, we can oh, get deep. Okay, okay. You just walked in on your wife cheating. <laughs> Go. Bitch, who the fuck is this nigga? I told you you can fuck other niggas, just not in my bed, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, bro? Yeah, my name Craig. Yeah, my, get the fuck out of my bed, nigga. Okay, man. Now I ain't gonna shoot you. Uh-oh. Please don't. Yeah, but you need to get on. All right, bitch, put your clothes on and go with him. Oh. I got a bitch coming through now. <laughs> I can't be mad at you, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's something I'm doing wrong. Right. You know what I'm saying? Ain't none of this shit my her fault. It's my fault. Why are you talking to him more than talking to me, goddamn? That's why I fucked him. You always be out with them niggas. He seemed like a cool nigga, man. What size you wear? 13? I got a pair of shoes for you, bro. Here you go. Take these J's, man. (laughs) Hold on, let me turn the camera off because all this shit on film. Yeah, yeah, I tape everything that happened. See! All right. That was. Cool. It's all right. First time. Mm-hmm. You get you get thirty to forty seconds to work out the scene. So all I'm right. gonna erase the shit. <laughs> See how I do right here. Mm-hmm. And Darlene, you can either give me or what's the, or, or Craig a thing. <laughs> Write it out. And it could Let's be see. anything. It could be anything. That's but funny. I ain't gonna do no gay shit. I knew it. See, that's why I said to me. You to me I already I said, know what you be on, goddamn it. Your little undercover Gay shit, you know, right, you know. Go on, come out the bag, D. Well, when you said the gay bomb, I was gonna. <laughs> that shit crazy. Can you, you see that? Yes, you ever I caught can. A che- you ever caught somebody cheating on you? Like caught them with your own eyes? Sort of. Sort okay. Of, exactly. You yeah, okay? Sort of. I ain't walking in on nobody fucking before, but I went over to this girl house and there was a dude over there. Uh-huh. Oh, leaving. He was all sweaty and musty. You. Her friend gave it away because they was all sitting on the porch. Her friend said. Okay. <laughs> Aha! Yeah, hey, I like caught Tom. you, bitch. Yeah. Oh, Tom Take. and Jerry. Aha! <laughs> Roll. Can you hmm. see that, D? Mm-hmm. Can you see this that? This going to be funny. Huh? Look, Look at the hiding and shit, God damn it. What? We don't give a fuck. I'm an improv expert. What's the motherfucker? That's what I say. Whose line is it anyway? <laughs> nigga said... Who is his name? <laughs> <laughs> you asked the nigga's name. <laughs> did I say a name? You asked him. You said, what's oh, your yeah. name, Oh, bro? yeah, yeah, I did. I did. <laughs> Man. Okay. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't want to take the time to fill out everything else, but. All right, what's the scene? The scene is, you're a drunk driver. You just got pulled over by the cops. For who, me? Go. All right. Hey, look here. Don't see. hurt me, motherfucker. Why is registration right now? I ain't got no license. I got old <laughs> child support. And that bitch Don't fucked move. Out. Don't move. You're moving too much. I hate Hispanic female cops. <laughs> <laughs> get out, then get out right now. I'm drunk, but can you see me? <laughs> Where your partner? I will rape you, bitch. You ain't got no oh, partner. That's it. You, you, he's going. He's well, going. shoot me, bitch. We got him. We got him. Shoot yeah. me, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, you going to jail <laughs> too, now, man? You got any priors? <laughs> right. Was this your partner? He Where was he at? It. He wouldn't have made it that far. I know y'all <laughs> fucking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Little funky ass police guy you about to put me in. Smell like feet. Oh, man. Oh, he's out. He's Smell done. Smell like feet he's and done. vinegar and soot. Oh, yeah. Arrest him. Arrest him. LAPD would kill you. Give a fuck if I go to jail, motherfucking shit. Oh, God. <laughs> Told a car. It's my bitch car. She put me out and I took her car. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Let's see. Whack. Okay, I got one. I was one. fun, dude. You was whack when you joined in. Shit, what do I got here? Craig got one. Can you write? Can you think? Yeah, I'm trying to think of what. I never think of uh, when, when a dark skinned dude be fucking your wife. <laughs> <laughs> That's cold blooded, man. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to make one for Frank and Jimmy over there. <laughs> Got Stop. the pee, but ain't no bathroom. That's <laughs> up. Woo. Oh. You know, I'm gonna make noise. Why are you pressing the thing so hard? That shit like, hey, hey, get off me, motherfucker. Hey, hey. Oh, it's hurting my jaw. Oh, it's hurting my teeth. I know. Oh, right now, like, oh. oh. He's scratching the chalkboard. Uh, huh. Harmony Clown somewhere. Uh, there she is. You and old boy put clothes on when y'all watch the show. <laughs> I forgot a fiance that. <laughs> okay, I got one y'all can do together. Oh, oh. you motherfucker. You put me with me. Oh. Uh, okay. All right, okay. go ahead. So what you say, okay, so uh, mm -hmm. you you a female trick, and you're trying to buy some, uh, <laughs> you're a prostitute, and you ain't got no money. You're trying to solicit him. You got to snap the thing. I'm <laughs> trying to pay him. But you ain't got no money, so you okay. ran out of money. Yeah, he's right. pretty, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm trying to get some from yeah, him. Yeah, you pull it up. He on, he on the male straw. Oh, all right. <laughs> Action. Beep, beep. Hey, what's up? You trying hey. to get some of this thing, got <laughs> Hey, done? big fella. You want some of this dough knob, got <laughs> Oh, is that what you working with? That's what's up. What is that got right? Let we got the glasses special. Let me see. Let me see. all over them motherfuckers. Let me see the goods. Let me see the paper. God damn it, I sell the dick. This ain't no relationship. I don't have any money on me. <laughs> However. <laughs> what you gonna do? I have this bucket of chicken right here. <laughs> by, the, and by the looks of you, <laughs> I think I'm set. Oh, shit. Uh, How goes it, handsome? How goes it? You look um, like you eat insects. <laughs> so there, boom. That was he funny. got in the car. He got in that the car. That was funny, okay. He got that in the shit car. shit was whack. Right oh, there. man. I can't wait till we do this segment with Zoe here, goddammit. I'm gonna be like the nigga Clippers broke, and you got to do the 5150 show. With no hat. Right. You stupid. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Huh. Hell no. Right, that was right, that was right. different yeah, for the first yeah, time. Yeah, right. It was all right. It'll get better. It'll get better. It was all right. Where so, do women go buy uh where do women go buy that? Don't go buy. You just we just go out and we'll get hit you on by up. some young yeah, that's how you know. Sounds you get hit on by young motherfuckers. Most women I get do. hit on by old motherfuckers. I do, but I don't want them. Like a, like a. You said you wanted the hobos last week. I didn't say I wanted him. I just happened to say that he looked really good for a homeless guy. That's saying you want him. Didn't say I wanted him. I'm just giving the man a compliment. He looked really good, and I told him too. He is very handsome. Mm. You see me complimenting any bitch. It's an effort to ski. Oh yeah. No, well that's different. Mandatory. That's the difference. Keep, that's but the ski. difference between you and I. I just, what's the difference between me and you? I'm not saying none of that stuff to him because I want to get with him. I just thought it would be nice and boost yeah. his morale. You wanted yeah. something from him. Why was you down I there? I did not. I felt bad for them. They had a dog, and they were trying to strap all their stuff to his cart. And he wanted to steal a dog. No, I gave them the little <laughs> joint, you know, my little... Um, a joint? Oh, y'all were smoking? Oh, the little tighten up joint, the ropes. Oh. What those called? Those a compliment things. is the handshake for sexual beginnings. That's how you start, you know. That's oh, how, well yeah. put. What book you still let out of? Man, I forget, I but it was, yeah, that was it. Well, that means I'm going to give it to everybody because that's what I believe in. I like giving my compliments. Because, you know, people can, you could just walk past somebody or drive past somebody or whatever, even in the store. And I'll look at somebody, and you know, a lot of times people just go in their minds, are saying, "Wow, that's a real nice whatever," or right. "Wow, this." I'll say it. Genevieve, you got a mic. Yeah. I'll say it. I will, especially men. They never get a compliment. Does that mic work? A right look there? is more than a, it means more than a verbal compliment coming from a female. Last mic no, on no, the well, end. Does that work? I didn't work? say that I was looking like that, but I'm just saying if I turn around, I saw somebody, then something hit me. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like yeah. I tell them, I just did it the other week in Target. I was it, like, "Excuse me." I like that. That salt and pepper you got going on. Oh, okay. I told him, I said, I like, I like that. And he was like, oh, my God, thank you. <laughs> oh, so he excited. started blushing. He bumped into the bike. <laughs> okay, Genevieve, I got a question for you. What do you think about people who've had more than 20 sexual partners? Um, and are you one? <laughs> I don't have to answer that, Genevieve. Oh, my God. No, I, I think more than, more than 20 is all right. Um, That's cool, right? 
I think that's all right, especially if you are like in your twenties, thirties, and oh, so you know, like if time. you're, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you are already in your thirties, I think uh, around thirties that that sounds mm-hmm. about like a a good number. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, that's cool. Okay, I'm gonna ask a couple other people. Thanks, yeah. Genevieve. I wanted to hear that. <laughs> Not if you're eighteen. <laughs> You eighteen year old female, so you D, got D, what do you think about people who've had twenty or more sexual partners? Well, you would question, you'd be suspect, you'd kind of just be a little little suspect of them, but how would you know? In other words, and who cares? What if they told Why you? Why would you ask? What if they well, say it's well over twenty? Oh yeah. wow. Uh, well, there's always protection. There ain't no well, fun when you gotta put a gun What about you? Yeah. You've had twenty or more? I will not answer that. <laughs> that means yes. No, it doesn't. Whatever. <laughs> He's always going to say whatever he Craig? thinks. Craig? Oh, yeah. I've definitely got over 20, man. Last what do you think about what do you think, <laughs> what do you think about a girl who's had more than 20 sexual partners? If she been fucking since she was 12, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> and it depends on how old she is. If she, if she 18, ah. Uh, that's a, that's a rough one. Really? But if she in her 30s, I'm expecting she got at least 30, 40 of them. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. yeah. To yeah. a year from 18 to, to, to 36. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That's, yeah. Mm-hmm. It don't matter to me. Mm-hmm. I want you to know, um, fellas, if you've had more than 20 sexual partners, you a boss player, motherfucker. <laughs> See, look at the double God standards. Damn, can't uh-huh. nobody tell you shit. You out there getting it, God damn it. Straight up. I want to say to all of the ladies who've had 20 or more sexual partners, you are the reason America is failing. All right? Your easy pussy is making it where guys don't do what they're supposed to do. If your pussy wasn't so easy, we would just be like, fuck it, I might well go and do right. So ladies, you need to be more responsible with that little twang between your twat. Oh, so is that what you consider then sexual? When you said sexual, does it have to go be penetration? Yeah, yeah you're such, oh. somebody Johnson got to be left oh. up in Digging your, your pussy. Yeah, mm. yeah. When, when two women do it, that ain't even sex. That's no, not I'm even intercourse. Women, yeah, okay. I'm that's hitting the brakes. Yeah. <laughs> Straight that's up. All, Smell like where I'm the airplane lands. <laughs> I'm saying if that's all a guy did to you. Like a boiled egg like factory. That doesn't count as a sexual encounter, then, is what you're saying. Say that again? Yeah. I'm saying when a guy just does that to you. Just does what? Goes down. You know, he doesn't. No, that ain't sex. Oh, okay. He's being taken advantage of. All right. If he's just going down, he He might be old. Oh, yeah. I mean, old niggas be dreaming about it. Them niggas in wheelchairs. I'll suck the shit out of pussy right now. I can't (laughs) do nothing else with it. If you eat some pussy and the girl don't want to fuck you afterwards, (laughs) you got to be a. You a. Punk ass, you a no, there's some bitches out here who just like getting their pussy ate by dudes and then they be like, get the fuck on. <laughs> oh, yeah. That happens in life. I can't imagine. Did that never happen to you? No. Congratulations. I've done. What? She, she calling getting, me over for some head? You ready to tell the truth? <laughs> I'm trying to, I, I can't think I've ever just been called over for some head and nah, it's on my coming way. out. It's coming out. First it was no. <laughs> Nice, I don't think. <laughs> I've been called over for some hair, but I always end up fucking They break the bitch. <laughs> Strong arm the bitch. Give me that. Yeah, she was already testified. She was already testified. I mean, I was, uh, uh, mm, see? You never know. I done got got like that twice in life. I know both of them motherfuckers. Man, yeah, that's. I wind up getting them later on. Dog them the fuck out. <laughs> bitch, you had me eat your pussy <laughs> and go home. Yeah, uh. <laughs> you a rotten bitch for that. Oh yeah, I'm gonna make yeah, you pay for that. Yeah, that. I always, I got yeah. both of them oh. back. God damn it! At one time, I had a, a, a older chick had uh, something worse than that. A, a older chick you made her ass, didn't? Nah, nah. I, I, <laughs> I, I, I fucked the bitch's back knee. Back knee. Yeah, that's the that space. Knee? That's the yeah. space between the, oh. the, the, her calf and her. Why quad. does she want you to fuck her back knee? I was in. <laughs> I didn't have no well, condom. I was a young nigga. Sake, you, you know what I'm saying? I think I was 17. She oh, was 28. He different. said he had no condom. <laughs> she cocked her leg up like that and put some some uh, some ointment right there, and I smacked her back knee, oh, man. Oh my! Shot God. off and everything. <laughs> I remember I didn't have no condom, and this girl made me get up and go to the store and shit, goddammit. I motherfucking came back, said, they ain't had no rubbish, oh. not what? <laughs> right, right. She was like, they, you, what store you went to? I went oh. to the one right down the street. What? <laughs> I went to Jiffy. Want me to go to another one? <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. And she stood on it. She was like, well, we can't do nothing. I was like, you all right with hey, me, yeah. Mercedes, you remember that when I pulverized your back knee? Oh. 
uh, Mercedes, you put the name out there. Yeah, yeah. she was bad in the motherfucker, too. I wasn't about to go back to the store. Her pussy wasn't worth it. The, the, the thrill was gone. I was like, I got another bitch stay down the street hey, yeah, who really let me nice. fuck her raw all the time. Yeah, I ain't about to go get no rubber. You got a quarter mile store radius. As he's walking away, itching. <laughs> Goodness <laughs> sake. If it take longer than five minutes, I ain't coming back. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> that. <laughs> Straight up. Man. No, I came back. I wanted to see homeless, what she I'm said about that rubber shit. Really <laughs> What'd you say, D? No, they're talking about the homeless. I don't know. He, he was a really good looking guy. The homeless dude? Yeah. D, mm. stop your pathological lying ass up. I, Let's go find him. He I, at that same corner. Maybe. It was a white dude. Very handsome. A white dude? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. He's very handsome. You didn't, yeah. I, oh, you never knew the He whole probably time. thought he was better than oh, you. Oh, you just assumed it was a brother. <laughs> Look at him. You see there? That's what he gets. He finally fuck a white dude and he homeless. <laughs> white, homeless? I've been with white guys. If you he have? Was. Yes, I have. I told you. I'll even show you pictures of the Well, where he at? What do you mean, where is he at? Why they don't never he, stick around? He got too possessive. He... He was well, a I mean, they used to own niggas, so you know they're going to get possessive. <laughs> 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 no, they think had, everything belonged to them. What type of, of white the, guy was it? John B. Butt. type or Nick Nolte type? No. Get your ass over here, D. Somewhere in between. He was a lot of fun, though. He was, he was a funny John guy. John B. from my city. <laughs> what city? Pasadena. Pasadena. <laughs> Pasadena. <laughs> he really grew up around all niggas. He really, yeah, he really, he wasn't playing. No, he uh, didn't. He didn't have any flavor or anything like that. Yeah. He was just bold, and I appreciated that that night because all these guys were like, but nobody. And he asked. So he was one of them jackass type white boys, like yeah. in the kind movie of, Jackass. Kind of. <laughs> he kind played of. a prank on you. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So anyway, I seen John B. get knocked out of Summer Jam in '98. Come here, D. Let me give you my cock. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. But no, that's why we broke up. Well, I only dated him for three months, but when, but he acted very possessive. He left you or you left him? I told him that it wasn't going to work out. Give me, what's some, what's some overly possessive? What's something he did? Uh, he kept showing up at, at the time I was doing marketing for clubs. Uh -huh. My son was probably about 12. And so I would leave late at night. I'd have our engineer watch him. He'd be in the house. And I would leave and go do clubs i don't know if you know what club managers so we would yeah. sell bottle would sell tables right so i worked for a guy who had <coughs> high-end clubs in hollywood and he would end up showing up he knew what nights i was gonna be and i'm like why do you, i'm working no, oh I'm yeah sit here i was like oh my god yeah. he got rid of him because he wanted to be close to his boo that ain't being close yeah. to his boo that no, was a that's why Come you're not on. happy you don't go you with somebody's was that the first white guy no uh-uh oh. what no. about the other 20 well, it was not a 20 <laughs> it was jared in junior high he was a punk rocker Remember I told you the guy with the um with the um. I don't remember shit. I said it a couple weeks ago. He don't anybody be listening to you? He had a mohawk, Jared. And he was fine. He was really handsome. He, he had, had a ponytail mohawk. No, he had just a mohawk. Oh, that's funny, little <laughs> <laughs> He's stupid. Ah, oh, that's. As says the, says the cornrow wearing fool around that time. I saw your cornrows, Corey. Man, wow. You ever had cornrows? Uh, for like two months, <laughs> See? Yeah. I look stupid <laughs> than a motherfucker. <laughs> I'm thinking about that. <laughs> I ain't got the head for it. I used to get them every summer. Yeah, yeah. Really? Oh, yeah. I'll show you pictures. I, I used to get them every it. summer. Oh, you every like summer. Bo Derek Ortiz? No, I did not have those. No, those were braids. Those little micro blade braids. I didn't have those. I had actual cornrows. You had really? fat cornrows. Yeah. Yeah. You used yeah. to wear them with the Allen Iverson jersey dress and the high heel jellies. Mm. <laughs> I'll show you some pictures. Oh, yeah. Okay, we will, we'll be looking for them next you week. You ever smack a white girl? Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm going to tell you Look, something. He, I, he gonna, I didn't hit a couple of girls, but it was because they hit me. See, he I'm not talking himself. about literal smack, nigga. I'm talking about stroke off. <laughs> Oh, stroke Yeah, on. beat up on, you know, beat the coochie up, nigga. Man, when I was in high school, man, yeah. I had... <laughs> he didn't confess. Hey, nigga, no. <laughs> no. I, I had a white bitch with a car, nigga. Oh, yeah. I, I had was a, a hooper, up. nigga. Yeah. I had a motherfucker. Nigga, I had a white bitch with a car. I was... <laughs> nigga, motherfucker was like, she got a car? I was yeah, like, yeah. yeah, this bitch got a car. Oh, yeah, see? Yeah. He over here got We got a car. Talk. He got room to talk. Yeah. I found out this bitch was fucking... Everybody, oh, oh, but claiming me, and it worked because she had a car. Uh -oh. oh yeah, I didn't want to let that car a... go. Hell yeah, uh -huh. 
My freshman year of college. Pussy belonged to the streets, though. I had a white chick. I got. She let me use her car when she went home for the summer. I got fifty parking tickets on that <gasps> motherfucker. <laughs> I used to just pull up in the red on purpose, nigga, <laughs> and hop out. Yeah, this ain't this hurt. Yeah. Jesse Judge Joe Brown. Well, you knew that you uh, had to drive the car in the first place. <laughs> I was the. She had a little boy. I was doing donuts in that motherfucker. And I was acting a fool, nigga. Oh, uh, yeah. I got in a few little accidents. Oh, Shout out to Michelle like, in Arizona. Look, My uh, bad. I don't remember look. the bitch name. All I know is she was um, short. What? How could you forget her name? It was I only white. I don't remember no what? bitch name from high school. Are you serious? How you remember bitch's name? I remember. I remember a Damn, few. How many? Did you get? Yeah, I can remember. What? Yeah. When I was hitting white girls, I, I used to like the white girls where I was the first nigga. Uh, I don't like the ones that got the corn rolls. White bitches called you nigga. Oh Uh-oh. come on, man. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? The first nigga. That's it's cool to be the first nigga, man. Mm-hmm. Okay, if you say so, goddamn. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyway, well, they go all motherfucking put it on the line. Yeah, <laughs> Caucasian tales. Yeah. The Caucasian tales. Yeah. Yeah. I had a few bad summers, man. I wanted to smash a couple of them, though, since I've been grown. I smash now. I ain't hit one in like 10, 10 years plus. I smash. Mm-hmm. I smash. Yeah, it's been a minute. I just can't keep you. I can't keep you. No. I can't be seen with you. Oh. <laughs> that I don't mind. I'm actually, you want me to tell you what, what I, a little phobia I have? What? I have a bad phobia that, because you know, a lot of them be killing their wives and stuff later when like money problems. That stuff. possessive you was I talking I don't like, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. See, I don't like that. That's kind of scary to me. Like they too into that. Let, let them go too broke and they just will do you, the whole family or you or. I don't like that. That's they think crazy. they own. Some people think they own you. See, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, you know, you can't own nobody. If a man want to kill good. you, that means your pussy good. A lot of these bitches ain't got nothing to worry about. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's some real shit. Your pussy ain't sitting yeah. before. You going to break up with me? <laughs> well, fuck you, man. <laughs> that's funny. No, that's scary. That's oh, real, that's motherfucker. Scary. Yeah. I, so, mm-hmm. I done hit a few big ones too. Three hundred pounders. I got two of them under my belt. No, I got a couple of them under my belt. You know. I got one. The pussy was too good. Oh yeah, Retu- I used man. to hate when she called me, but when I get over there, I'd be like, <laughs> damn. I- <laughs> fall right in, fall this right in line. It's good. <laughs> she had a big foot too. Oh man, oh, man. That's about that the big feet. fat foot. Oh okay, the, okay. The side way, yeah, yeah, I right. Know, yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. Where it goes that, off to the sides on the sides. The ankle part real small, but the whole foot big. <laughs> <laughs> like she got a super Achilles. Goes off. <laughs> super Achilles. But her foot was soft, so one day when I made a mistake and touched it, I was like, oh, that ain't too bad. Uh, <laughs> How you touch it way up here? Oh. The leg was up there. Yeah. Better let that bitch ride me, bitch. Oh, nah. Before it gets too late, if I can. Don't yeah. plug in the new dresses, Can we please? Before Go ahead, plug it. Why you ain't wear one? What do you mean? Look at it. What am I going to wear underneath it? These are dresses that's for being sexy. God well, I know. I'm going to wear, yeah. The girl's going to be wearing this summer. I this might wear trend. one around the house. I mean, uh, next week. Uh-huh. This is the Valentine's Day one. That's the motherfucking the edition. pink and red. Yes. And it's got pockets, got adjustable straps. Super, super cute. Super cute. All these different colors, ladies. They got yeah, pockets. they have pockets. It's so great, so comfortable, and the material is incredible. You can put oh, your pills well, in the pocket while you cook. So we have all these different Dope colors. Fingers. All these different What's colors. The green. Yep, money green. I call that one. The other one was like a stone gray. Another like Valentine type one? edition. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'll wear one next week. Ooh, what color this is, is my that? Favorite. Violet. Violet. Oh wow. Mm-hmm. That's that bitch who be popping up at your job. Who up there? Violet out and there. And then the royal. Get one for my g- what is that? The pocket, but what color is that? Like a royal purple. Yeah, that's dope. Mm-hmm. Spaghetti Beautiful. strap in the game. Yes. That, that monkey accessible yeah. like a motherfucker. Ooh. You don't wear draws yeah. with them, lady. <laughs> no, you don't. You got to be able to see all that movement. That kind I of see material. See that wiggle. When hugs in yeah. the back. Yeah, yeah. All and when the dress get up in that yeah. ass, goddammit. <laughs> yeah, when you get up, accidentally it's in there. <laughs> right. <laughs> Nate, Nate Jackson just texted me. He want to know if you got a 5X for <laughs> the dress. <laughs> a 5X you know. for the dress. <laughs> Nate, Nate, stop. Put that motherfucker <laughs> <laughs> No, but those dresses run big. Yeah. It, right, because that's a small. And see how... Uh, they run big. So I'm great. just letting you know. Comfy. And where is his name? Your girl looking? can fit it. We got small, medium, large, X large. Fuck with us. You know we got it. 
Gosh, yeah. what is his name? I gotta find that's it. Dope. Gotta Cut the fuck out it. my finger playing with this damn knife. Yeah, that's a real oh, deal. Fish give, gutter. I usually don't give like a, a, a just one personal shout out to the uh, couple of weeks, you know, the people that be buying and supporting the show. Okay. And I don't want to say how much he spent, but it was incredible. Really? I think it's the we most. about Bailey? Somebody's... No. Oh. No, Bailey, Joseph Bailey's usually the first to order the new items, but Whomever this Sharif Caldwell is, he's got his whole family, his lady, every he's hooked up. Don't want to say the price, but thank you, Sharif Caldwell. That's Word up. thank you, motherfucker. <laughs> that was a, a a first. That was a first what he did. So thank you, and he's from East Orange, New Jersey. Thank you, Sharif. Shout out. I'm still getting that street paper out there. Ooh. Hell yeah. Ooh. Sharif, orange, Lord. got them. He's the dope of the military, and he's going. <laughs> you gotta get them fifty-one fifty pocket knives. No, Corey, nigga named Sharif, he getting that paper on the street, dog. Oh yeah, hell nigga yeah. In the army, hey, that hey. street paper, got them. Let yeah. uh-huh. wrap that shit up, got them. Put it on your tongue <laughs> and just hold that. <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah. So next week we will have a special guest. A friend of mine's coming. She was supposed to come this week. It's okay with you though, right, Corey? I can bring her. So who is the bitch? Oh gosh, don't say that. Well, no, I'm saying like if, if let, maybe we shouldn't say it unless we know she's coming for sure. She said she's coming. I'll show you the, the messages. She said she's, she said coming, she's coming, coming tonight. The watch. No, 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 no. Too, right? She said she would swing by if she could. She's too far out. She's in Long Beach, and just see the show. She's not familiar with it. She want, but I asked. She wanted her to, to watch it. I would love yeah. for her to come. That's so big. She's coming. Yeah, it is big. It is. That's big. Yeah, yeah that's a dope. female sleeper guest. Yep. Okay. I guess I could say who it is. Maybe people could do their research and 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 maybe look up some of her. What is she stuff. coming for show? She's coming. Yes. Okay. Yes. Well, we gonna see. All right. You cool. gonna drop a day or you gonna leave it alone? I'm gonna leave it alone. That's pretty big though. That's pretty huge. Her okay. dad. Yeah. Her dad. She's got. She's. She's. And she's representing all his stuff and everything right now. So yeah. That's what's up. Yes. All right. So we finna get ready to motherfuck shut it down. God damn it. Fuck it. Nigga, motherfucker about to hit the street, nigga. Hell yeah. Dallas, Texas. I'm going to Arlington. This weekend, wow. Arlington Improv. Um, we got shows sold out already. How's they the weather over there? It's a little chilly in tele- Texas yeah. this weekend. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you should be prepared then. That's where yeah. you're going, right? Yeah, I'm going. Nice. I'll be there. You I'll got be a coat? There. I got a coat, but I, you know, oh, I, California I, is cold. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no lining, you gonna be cold. Yeah, I got it. Well, how cold it get out there? What hey. It ain't real cold, but oh, it's okay. gonna be like thirty some nights. Oh wow! So it's well, gonna come be a little on. chilly. That is cold. At night, it's gonna drop down. Right, right. So yeah, you know, I think I got one. Dallas get a little winter. They don't get no hellified shit all the time, but they get a little winter. Okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I can't wait. Hey, watch this, goddammit. What's the weather going to be like in Dallas, Texas this weekend? Uh-oh. Bitch, I say, what's the weather going to be in Dallas, Texas this weekend? <laughs> Some bad weather coming up for Dallas, Texas Ooh. for this weekend. Down to 28 degrees and Sunday is going to be 28 raining. Saturday is going to be 64 during the day, 30 at night. Ooh, come on now. Oh, That's wow. that shit where it be all right, but you got to have your... Yeah. Do you coming? What do you mean am I coming? You said you got to wear your flip-flops. No, I said I couldn't wear my flip-flops, and I've been wearing them for two days straight. Oh, hmm. your flip-flops. I know them motherfuckers uh, smell like the uh, handsome hobo feet. <laughs> <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> wear flip-flops. People got to clean flip-flops. Oh, I yeah. I got some special ones, and they have massaging things on the bottom. Anything touch human skin, you got to clean. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Say that again. Well, that is cold hey. for us. Come on now. You got to clean even the. the that's what's, chilly for us, yeah. Californians. You got to clean the nose part on the glasses. That's got to be clean. The, the glasses part stank up there. Them little, them little holders smell. Yeah, oh my! God. Here, you want <laughs> screw them off and sniff them. <laughs> hey! Check and see if it's. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's not true. Hell yeah, yeah, I clean the inside of my that, watch. That, oh, that for sure. On oh, it. Inside yeah. of your watch, got that. Hell them. yeah, you got to clean everything. Rubber you slept in. <laughs> Behind your ears. Yeah. When you're you know, asleep. if you sleep in a rubber, like if you don't get up and wash up and you got them rubbers on, especially them lambskin rubbers, right. they stick to you. It right. hurt to take off. Okay. You be like. 
<laughs> like, like you put some Elmer's glue on your dick. I got to start using rubbers again so I can figure that one out. <laughs> Hell no! This motherfucker <laughs> trust everybody. I trust no. it. anything over a seven. I'm not using the rubber, man. Playing yeah, crap. They still live. <laughs> Craig, no. I check her ID. That's but all. It. Popping them motherfucking expensive ass <laughs> pills, goddamn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, mm, yeah, mm, man. Mm, mm, mm. Look, goddamn it. Um, I don't know if we talked about this. I just gotta say it because it be on my mind, like. Uh, Ventura Boulevard is a um, street out here, L.A. Everybody know about it when you, once you get to the Valley. Um, a former NBA player that uh, is yeah. known in L.A. and <coughs> um, in, in the circuit because he hangs out and he 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 always. Um, in my, I've never seen him not in a good mellow mood. Yeah, he was good people, man. His name wow. is Rasul Butler. He passed um, him and his wife in a car accident mm. uh, this weekend and uh, I rolled past that little area where they crashed and a lot of people put them candles and stuff over there mm. and shit and it's like uh, so sad. I see the pictures of him you know on social media and shit yep. and uh, I, I just wanted to tell everybody out there man like we, we all can't help it but to take life for granted at times we can't help it right Cause as soon as you get relaxed and shit, but the young brother wasn't but thirty eight years old, mm. from what I understand, and uh, I'm just saying, man, while you alive, man, you better enjoy this shit, man. If you around somebody, man, where it's always drama with them, man, get the fuck away from them people, man. I know you don't want to let that pussy go, let that dick go, whatever it is. Life too short to be arguing with a motherfucker all the time. Yep. Mm-hmm. I yeah. mean, like, I, I'm just saying this shit, man, because I know some people who just really not happy most of the time when you see them. Mm. And I'd be one to say, man, motherfucker, you a lot. Yeah. Straight up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Those people, you just wasting your time. You can't. You can't. Even tell I them saw that this. brother going into the uh, grocery store on Ventura, you know, yeah. a few weeks ago. You don't think about shit like that. Nah, not at mm-hmm. all. He pulled up in this little uh, Range Rover, but the windows was tinted. I ain't know who the fuck that was, but I knew it was somebody who knew me. Right. I was like, oh, what's up, my nigga? You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, he's yeah. he a cool nigga. Yeah, yeah. He, he was solid. Rest yeah. in peace. Man. Him and his wife. Both. Because they both passed in that car accident. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I don't know what the fuck happened, but it's not a good feeling. I haven't. I didn't know him real good, but right. I just know him. Oh, that's Rasul. Nigga. You would see him around. He used to play right. for the Clippers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. When, you, when we was down there at LLI. Oh, at the Conga Room. I used that's to see it, him yeah. a lot. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I think his wife was an R&B singer. I think so, too, yes. Yeah, yeah like, she was. Uh, she was on American uh, Idol, too, wasn't she, or something like that? Something like mm. that. See, yeah. I don't know her name. I'm, I'm embarrassed to say. Leah LaBelle, I think. Something like that. They yeah. both passed from a car accident. On fucking Ventura Boulevard. Yeah. How's that? How right on that? that curve. That curve right there by, is it Marshalls? By Marshalls. Yeah. Yeah, they still. Wow. They, yeah. they, I don't know if the memorial is still up. I, re, I rode past it yesterday, goddammit. Yeah, that's too bad. Uh, Damn. Yeah. I would it, always. It's just one of them things that shook me up because he was too young. Yeah. Yeah, 38 is way too 38, young. 38, man. Yeah. You 38, fucking. even in your 50s. My dad died at 54. <laughs> broke my heart. Yeah, that's still young. Yeah, that's 30. still young. That's too, really young. young. Yeah. No, it's just. Yeah, it's sad. You yeah. ain't old until you stop fucking. That's when you old. <laughs> no, when you silly. stop fucking, you no, old. No, when you're not allowed to drive anymore. I think that's when you're too old. When people oh. say, take the keys, can't drive When you anymore. can't drive, you can't go fuck. You know what? <laughs> <Stop. laughs> you Uber, pussy. <laughs> there you go, see? So. Yeah, that's <laughs> so called stupid. Rest in Peace, Rasul yes, Butler. Yes, please. And, Rasool and Butler. your wife. Rest in Peace, my brother. I just... It's weird, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. It's like it, it ain't even set in because I see the pictures of him on the social media, right? But mm-hmm. I'm like, damn, that's that's, a, that's yeah. the nigga. You, you know, when you him. see tall black people in the valley, yeah. you know, who is that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's dude. Yeah, you know yeah, 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 yeah. That yeah. shit crazy, man. Life too short, man. Life too short, man. Yeah, it's way too short, man. That's huh. Mm. And motherfuckers like Don Lemon still alive. <laughs> yeah, DJ Khaled's fiance's brother didn't die. He was murdered. Oh, Khaled! Wow. His fiance's brother. 
Oh, rest in peace. Yeah, they were out here celebrating the. Uh, rest in peace to all of the yeah, fucking people God. who fucking out here fucking living their life and it's taken from. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying, man. Better motherfucker live your life, man. Fuck that shit. You never live know. Live your life. Don't fuck with haters. Don't waste once your time. You, once you motherfucking establish somebody as a hater, get the fuck away from them people, man. Them people ain't finna do nothing but make it hard. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. They always find a way to say you did something to them. <laughs> <laughs> people like that. Get the fuck away from them people, man. Yeah. Yeah. Because you did this. You'd be like, really? Okay. Yeah, you got to watch them people because, you know, energy never dies. It transfers. And when a motherfucker confused about who they are and what they doing, they, they be frustrated. And they yeah. try to put that shit on you. Mm-hmm. Well put. Man, you got to get, mm-hmm. get get out the way, you know. All right. I'm going to say my quote of the day. Uh-oh, here we go. Not you got it down. Yeah, I was thinking Let's of some cold it. shit. I'm, I might put this on one of my new shirts and shit, uh-huh. God damn it. Mm-hmm. Uh... uh it's my birthday month. Oh, it's coming up. Doobie doobie do. February 26th. Oh, really? Are you Aquarius? No, that's Pisces. a. Your mind was on Sunday. Oh. You bullshit. Yeah. I what t- is you? Oh, happy birthday. Aquarius. Lady. February no 4th. Aquarius. Ooh, yeah. That's so sweet. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't. I don't <laughs> what's, bad, what, what's bad about it? No, I don't know. I'm, no, I'm, just I'm not into the sign. No. Huh? Yeah. When is your oh, yeah. birthday, Genevieve? That's right. Oh, I'm Libra, October 12th. Libra. Oh. Okay. October 12th. Doors mm-hmm. pass, huh? What about you? Um... <laughs> <laughs> they they together? They husband, husband and wife. wife. For real? Oh. Where y'all meet at? Internet? <laughs> really? No, I'm just fucking oh. with you. <laughs> 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 Stop. Yeah, yeah. Sort of, though, Genevieve. Sort of, yeah. 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 Sort of. That's funny. Radio internet. Uh-huh. The birthdays come fast. No. When's you your doing? birthday? Uh, March 4th. He's Pisces. Oh. Pisces. Pisces in the house. Y'all was at D birthday last they year. They were. We had so much fun. That was a big one. I'm not having another one until I'm 75. <laughs> he had on dress clothes with sneakers. Oh, but nobody could see it because the dress was so long. It was so bomb because I had to yeah. dance. I'm a dancer. I. I Right, we had fun. I, Genevieve we and DJ has got We them. did, we danced. Yes, we did. I don't know why I'm blanking on this man's name. Look at this. I Frank? Frank. I oh, my God. Mm. Frank was jealous when um, D and Genevieve was dancing. He was like, hey, two clouds. <laughs> it was a whole matter. Everybody was out there dancing. Hell, yeah. I ain't big on birthday parties, dog. I just chill. I'm not with my either. Mom. I don't want no party. Yeah. I just hang out with you. Was it plan. a big numbered one? What did you turn? I turned 36. All right. Yeah. Good one. Yeah, okay. 36. I'm getting old, man. Oh, my God. Stop. Damn. 36. I God know. Damn. Look at yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> it's only Good 10 fun. years older than my son. Right. I was thinking, though, like, you know, when you're, like, young, like 11, 12, when you got all these, like, all these visions of where you're going to see yourself. Mm-hmm. I like where I'm at, but I, this ain't where I thought I would be, though. Right. What did you think you would be, nigga? I thought I, you know what I'm saying, be the richest nigga on the planet. You know what I'm saying? Why? I don't know. You know when you're when young, you, know, you, you just want to be rich and popular, yeah. you know? Yeah. I had no idea I'd be in this little Ricky Nick studio with a superstar. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, please don't be some you know like what I'm saying? Yeah, right, D. Go ahead on, <laughs> God damn it. That's why your glasses you know stank. They do not. Yeah, yeah. Some <laughs> nose odorant. The case Nose odor. <laughs> the case might, but not really. You, are you where you thought you would be when you was a little? Uh, I ain't never thought about it. God no. Damn it. Mm. For real? I live for the day, motherfucker. Another yeah. hour. Yeah, for real <laughs> tough. That's what I'm on now, though. Now, that's yeah. what I'm saying. He, I mean, he don't know what he when he was little. No, I got, I got shit. I want, I, I, you know, I, I got shit going on now. I got my mm. mom. I'm finna move out here to L. A. with me. So, yeah, I got a motherfucking. I got to be on top of my shit because I got to take care of my mom. Yeah, straight up. Mm-hmm. So my life finna change, God damn it. Right. I, I got shit I got to live for. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Straight up. Make sure she's straight, God damn it. Mm-hmm. So yeah, it matters. True. I figured out, though. That's how I always thought, man. I used to be around rich niggas when we used to hoop. The rich niggas be like the coaches of the basketball tournaments and shit. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> All yeah, the drug yeah. dealers yeah. with the coaches yeah. and That's shit. That's funny. God damn it. What's up, Tiger? But uh, <laughs> I'm saying, I'm yeah. saying like, 
I never was like envious of niggas with money. I never gave a fuck. I was like, I'll be all right. I'll figure it out. Mm-hmm. Right, yeah, for sure. I always felt that way. Like, I ain't got money now, but I ain't got no money now. But I, agree, yeah. I got enough money to motherfucking go buy an outfit. That's all I got. I got outfit yeah. money. It ain't even about the money, though. But you know what I'm saying? It's just like when you get to an age when you start seeing yourself doing certain shit, I just realized that none of the shit I saw myself doing, I ain't you doing You thought you was going to be a doctor? Nah, hell no. Nah. What you thought you was going to be? I, I, you going to grow a gonna... ponytail? <laughs> <laughs> I can still grow Wait, a ponytail. Wait, though, Craig did yeah. show me a picture of his dad. Yeah. His dad looks just like my ex. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 he always talk about her ex. <laughs> no, I, he just showed Which you a ex? picture. You say your ex. Why do you say, ask that when you know I only have one? What are you, the people that I dated shortly after? Did you after? say you only got one ex? I don't care. <laughs> How can I count any of the other ones? Guys that I dated for like uh, a few months. Only, you can only have an ex if you was married to him, right? Yeah, oh, for 17 years. Well, you ain't got yeah. no ex. <laughs> oh, brother. Common law, fool. Oh, yeah, common you law, seven L. years. Shit, we were smarter than that. It, it don't, Some people it. went and got married in the courtroom. Yeah, uh-huh. I got married. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, you I went going? to the courtroom and got married next to the traffic citation? I got married in Vegas, nigga. Oh, See? okay, yeah. Worse. In Vegas? Worse. Fuck it, I'll do it. Hey, hey, hey. So That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> See? <laughs> exactly. Damn. Uh. <laughs> we um we um we finna get ready to get the fuck up out of here. But I do want to say to all of the homeless people around the country tonight in those cold states, I just oh. want to say to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> That's fucked up. Uh. All homeless people's clothes are pajamas. Every last outfit. <laughs> they sleep with that shit. I actually gave him that Zippo hey. thingy that you had that was kind of fleecy. Oh yeah. yeah oh, that's you dope. Want it, you donated. It was in the donation bag. I don't even know what you're talking about. Well, that's actually the freest you could be when you're homeless. You ain't got to answer to nobody. You ain't got to pay no bills. None of that. You just do what you want to do. And I gave him money for coffee. Yeah. He be fucking homeless, motherfucker. I on do his not. Road. I believe she make him wear rubbers, but oh my god, she let him eat pussy. Oh. I, I give it up when it's due, and he was handsome. Right. Yeah. The homeless dude? I, oh, yes. You gave it up to him? Did not. Stop being crazy. Oh, you talking That's about silly. the clothes? Yes, I gave him the clothes. I gave him that zip-up. It was, it was all fleece. It was a whole bodysuit. It was like a, a Under Armour thingy or something. You had it in the, the donation pile. Or was it that body suit you had on a couple no, weeks ago? No, no, no. no. <laughs> That's my new no, polo this uh, suit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, this thing was go, fleece. Uh, it was a fleece okay. lined. Yeah, yeah, like a jumpsuit thingy that you wear underneath clothes, like when it's really cold. Ain't no telling what yeah. Deedon did. It's some oh, really God. talented homeless people, man. Yeah. Sly good. from Sly and the Family Stones Stone, was homeless yeah. for a while. He a genius. Yeah. It's a, it's a couple, man. A couple. Yeah, it's some... If you're talented and homeless, man, get keep your head up. Get back out there and do whatever it is you used to do. Mm, that's tough. They say Darlene got a bang bro scene somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> a what? In the back of a minivan. Right. Oh, stop. <laughs> that's funny how they was leaving, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's messed up. Yeah, yeah. No, anyway. All right, fuck y'all. 5150, exactly. we up out, this bitch, motherfucker. <laughs> Stupid.